My name is Tank. I'm Jay Valentine. This is the r and <laughs> Money Podcast. The authority yeah. on all things, all things. R&B. Yeah. Oh, yeah. it's getting sexy today. What? Oh, it's, getting, it's, it's, it's getting warm. It's getting interesting. You know, there's brains. There's beauty. Yeah. There's a gift. Yeah. There's skill. Real vocals. Oh, real vocals. Yeah. All wrapped up in the one. A real pen. Real awesome package. Yeah. Let's not waste any time on this. Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for Miss Carrie Hill standing in the building. Yeah. 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 Y'all are so sick. Yeah. I, I don't know how to sing the Miss Carrie baby thing. That yeah. Nobody got to do it. I, I don't have it. Do it. Come on. Come on. <laughs> come on. I always sing. Come on. I don't know how to sing the Miss Carrie baby thing. Come on, Jay. It's weird. Come it's on! Weird. It's, weird. It's, it's definitely it's, weird it's, now. Yeah, it'd be weird for me to say. Yeah, yeah. You had 10 uh, seconds. Ten, yeah, there was a 10 second grace period. Shit. Yeah. Yeah. What okay? Nothing. Nothing. It's all, Beauty. Yeah. Life. Yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? That's how you feeling? I feel feeling like light and love. Yeah. Like you on some grand rising shit right now? I am on my grand rising. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! King. I, he hates grand I'm rising. Hate King. I'm fucking hate. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, get away from me! <laughs> you and them goddamn rocks. What is them things? Uh, crystal. The crystal. <laughs> rocks. I see where this shit going. Crystal. All right, oh, crystals and tarot cards. Crystals and, shit. and tarot <laughs> cards. <laughs> look! Look! Oh shit! I don't go that far. How far you go? I got some crystals. You got some crystals? I have an altar. Okay. Mm-hmm. And you know, I and meditate. You, and you know what every crystal does. You you. Yeah, I know what they do. Sometimes you recharge them? I have. Yes, I charge them. Okay. Yes, under the full moon. Okay. Um, some checking. can be charged with water. Okay. Some I'm just with making... the sun. I charge I mean? my car. It's different things. You charge your car. You, Jay. Get about three twenty five to three fifty out of it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a, you know what I mean? It's a nice size battery. <laughs> Do you charge your body? Do you do you ground? That do you I put do. your feet ever since I met Eric ever, B. Ever May. since we had Eric <laughs> B. May, we put Eric, our feet on the ground. Eric okay, B. all right. What? Thank you, Eric Benet, huh? for teaching yeah. these young he, he, pavement. Because I'm a Timberland boot kind of nick. You know what I'm saying? That's just where yeah, yes, I feel like I you got to wear your Timberland boots oh, at all remember. times. Oh, we remember. I don't give a fuck what you're doing. We remember you, you in the Timberland. Come on now, Timberlands and snow socks. Well, I'm Asian. It impeded the... So I get my... I get, I what little danceability you had already. Oh, shit. It oh, impeded... Shit. Wow. But maybe it was the Tim's all over. Is that how all, we start this shit off? <laughs> we gonna, we gonna, is this what did you doing? It? Did you? Uh, <laughs> did you? you <laughs> this is the bullshit I'm talking about. First it's of my, all, I was a hell of a dancer. Ooh, oh, let's start shit, there. Shit, hell of a. I wasn't Chris Brown. Okay. Okay. I was maybe his cousin, Nick Brown. But I wasn't Chris <laughs> Brown. Nigga Brown. <laughs> Nigga, <laughs> Nigga Brown. <laughs> <laughs> they should put that in the crayon box. <laughs> <laughs> It's brown and it's nigga brown. That's oh crazy. my god! It would be a whole box though. Okay, oh, it's so many. It'd it's, be a whole that'd be box. A, that'd be a hella rainbow brown. Yes, it, it would. It'd anyway, have for, to be a whole box of crayons. First of all, I was nice with the dance. I was nice with the choreography. My improv was a little, little, little questionable. Okay, but, all right. But my, I'll give you that you were my, in the choreography. But my choreo- Thank you. you my choreography it. was that right. That you did it. Thank you. You had it you, you right. You had of, it. Do you have some of them crystals on you so I can meditate while this nigga over here talking this <laughs> shit? First of all, I, I got a lot of, I got, I got a lot of, you know. Y'all make sure y'all Google the freaky video, please. And, go, and, and, and Google the you, You're My Star video, which I did really well in. You have said so yourself. I did. I did. You I did. I did. So Had to give it up. Yourself. So you're not the only one who dances, Carrie. <laughs> I actually don't. You stop? Really. No, I mean, I, I've i never considered I mean, myself done choreography, that I can do, yeah. dance, but I don't. You know what I mean? Okay. Anyway, <laughs> right. thank you, Carrie, for for hanging out with us. I yeah. mean, we've been doing this for a month of Sunday, yeah. so this is, you know, this is not formal. This is love. This is our opportunity um, to give you the love and the flowers that you deserve and also an opportunity for you to pop your shit. No. Oh, yeah. Because you, cause you, cause yeah. you are what you are. And cool, you've done what cool you've shit. done. And yeah. you're doing what you're doing. All right? So what we're going to do is we're going to take this shit back to the beginning. Oh, Lord. Yeah, yeah. Come on. Okay. We want to know where it come from. No. Come on with we want to know oh. where it starts. Oh, come beginning. on with it. Yes. 
You got to shout out your beautiful mama. I'm going to say hi to my girlfriend oh my God. real quick. <laughs> hey, mama. This man has had a crush on my mom for what, 20, 20 years now? Easy. A pretend Easy. crush. I know. It might be it's real. real. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Take us back. When did, when was it identified that that you had this? By others or me? Both. Yeah. Okay. I knew that I was special or different around three or four. Hmm. I remember people always asking me to sing. Whatever song I knew, whatever. I just remember being at like family reunions and being that young and just like, okay. I felt like a karaoke. That's why I ended up naming my publishing company karaoke oh, music yeah. I mean karaoke songs mm -hmm. because I remember as a young kid it was like Carrie sing Carrie sing all the way up through church retreats all the way up to high school you know what I mean it was always that so it was like I was like I felt like a karaoke machine so anyway as young as three and four that began I was like why is everybody that that would be my way of having attention or not saying that came out wrong but that would be the way that I, that the only way that people would pay attention to me mm -hmm. okay and so, of course, you're that young. You're going to notice that pattern. It's just like, okay, when I'm singing, there's everybody's... Everybody stops. Everybody stops. Yeah, everybody's yeah. looking down at me. Mm -hmm. And I'm, you know. So, my mom said, um, she knew, I guess, around this... She probably knew sooner. She's... Let me go to singing, though. Singing, I would say she... She finally believed enough to let me enter a talent show in first grade. Oh, that's early. That's and early, she bought yeah. me sheet yeah. music. Well, if I was begging for a few years mm -hmm. to perform. Yeah. And, you know, um, but she let me do that just to see, just like, what's this little girl? What is she, you know, yeah. all I ever did. On did, the anyone VHS. Else, did anyone else in the family sing? My dad used to sing. My dad would sing at the fireplace with some drinks. That's how he would wind down. He would come home tipsy and say... Hey, everybody. <laughs> he would sit us down and perform for us at the mantle. Do you remember what he was saying? Mm -mm. That is great. It might. I'm sure my mom remembers. I'm sure my mom remembers. And you guys I, were I don't his, think I would be able to Y'all were his audience. We, his. <laughs> now, we were a big audience, though. It was seven of us. Well, six others than him. Yeah. Six. Oh, yeah. Family of seven, mm -hmm. okay? Yeah. So we had a big-ass audience. So we would sit on the couch, line up. Some of us sit on the floor, and Dad would be at the fireplace singing for us, and we would just clap. We were annoyed a little bit sometimes. <laughs> we were, sometimes right. we'd be asleep. Right, right. Oh, shit. He rounds y'all up. He oh, it was real. It was real. When he was ready to sing, he was ready to sing. I'm ready to sing. I got a concert tonight. I got a gig tonight. I got a gig. Need y'all to pull up. He's only talking to his kids, though. I need y'all to pull up. Oh, yeah, shit. and that we look like we awesome. Like, and my mom would be like, "He's drunk," <laughs> you know. Ah, Get him in your body because I have yeah. one, one, maybe two. <laughs> <laughs> now, now I'm an alcoholic. <laughs> <laughs> Everything goes back to the five yeah, bar beat. Yeah. Okay, got it. That is awesome. Yeah, so I got it from him for sure. Mm -hmm. um, but my mother's mother was a performer, and my dad's side, all of them sing. His sister, his mother. But my mother's mother was a, a performer. Like she was a, um, what do you call a baton twirler? There's a more professional name for it. Okay. Majorette. Majorette. She's a majorette. Gotcha. Through adulthood. Mm -hmm. Oh, sure. She was for a long time and she would perform and people would come to see her. and da -da -da. So that, um, I think the performance probably came from her. Mm -hmm. okay. um, so maybe you had it in the I'm blood. Like the, yeah, yeah, I'm like the, the, the mesh. mesh. Yeah, yeah, I'm like the mesh. Yeah. And, your and first, that was a later revelation. And your first talent show, would, how do you My do? My first talent show, I won. Oh, shit. I won. And it was a big one. It was, it was, you had to compete for some reason, one through seven, like first grade through seventh grade, because we didn't have middle school. So it was one through seven, and then eighth through twelfth was high school. Mm -hmm. So they had two categories. So I won for the elementary category. Yeah. Oh. But you were first grader and you beat everybody else. Everybody else. Yeah. All the way seven up to grade seventh grade. Yeah. I sang <laughs> home pissed. I sang home from the Wiz. Ooh. In a polka dot dress. Now I think of home. And a side ponytail. Think of a place. Mm -hmm. ah. 
Oh, Did you have all the theatrics and everything too? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Mom coached me through. She bought me the sheet music and the karaoke tape. Ooh, y'all remember? Y'all, yeah. Did you ever have... Did any of no. y'all... No? What? Sheet music it's, and the did, tape to go with it? No, like no, a, no, like no, a no. Mu- just, instrumental. We just they, to, we those just instrumentals to used to be terrible. Yeah. We just had to just learn it. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Acapella. Yeah. yeah. And just, I'd have to record it off of the radio, whatever it was, then play the cassette a bunch of times and then just sit at the piano. Yeah, I never had a karaoke tape. Yeah, it was, he was yeah. rich. Y'all didn't go, you was rich! <laughs> I, could, uh, tape? I don't think I could what? record me, though. I mean... If you could record you, that's a new level. You, you I'm had, just saying, we went to the music had, store. You kind of had a TV you track. Had, I had a TV, but you, had, you could buy them from record stores I had no and idea. piano stores. I had no idea. They had cover sheet, cover music. Sheet music. Okay, sheet music yeah. for no. covers. No. No? Mm-hmm. Okay. I wouldn't even get new shoes, let alone no goddamn Man. sheet music. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't start this and guy. A back and tape. <laughs> <laughs> I enjoy being poor. I like this. <laughs> I, I, ne- way more fun. I never want to go back. <laughs> I never want to go back. All right, you win the talent show. Yeah, it wasn't that enjoyable. And, and, and yes, does I this, won the talent show. Does this push mom to push you? Or does she this just no, or does just or does no. this just let you know you pushing, got it? I was pushing her. I got it. Yeah. Was oh, you was pushing her, her into it. Yeah. Absolutely. Okay. My mom was resistant the entire time. But she would acquiesce enough for me to like Say that word again? Acquiesce. She would hmm. You know that's what I mean? Going yeah, today. yeah, we're yeah going. I told you she's well studied. She's huh? smart. Yeah, this is, Not just beauty, this brains. College education. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, it's this a real college, too. Okay. Not the 13th grade. She would acquiesce. Okay. Yeah. She would acquiesce. She would. She would. She believed in like allowing us to, um, she would enrich our lives with a whole lot of different activities. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, there were some things I didn't want to do. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? But I had to do them. And if you wanted to play the piano, you're gonna do that, you know what I mean? You know that she she did believe in that, which I'm really really grateful because I'm like great at a lot of things. Mm-hmm. I'm great at like, pretty much everything I do. You know what I mean? It's it's, oh, it's good it's, at least. Yeah, yeah. It's I mean, pop your shit day. It's pop your for shit Carrie day. Hills, just letting you yeah. know this is yeah. this is what this is for. Continue. I don't suck at anything. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Anything you throw my way, anything you you think because I'm a girl, because I you know what I'm, I don't. I'm just saying. Do you it's real. do you feel like it's that's real. from? It's from my hard the work way that though? I and and your yeah. It's a character trait. Greatness is a char- character trait. Excellence, I believe, is so a character too. trait, yes. right? Yeah. But it's also from being exposed to so much so young. Mm-hmm. Okay. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Just yeah. So when so. did it become real? Like as you're as you're going through the talent show process, I'm sure mm-hmm. there were many of those. Yeah. As it was a local thing. Yeah. When does it become like, when does it get, get exposure on another level? Maybe a commercial or maybe a play, some mm. musical theater or, or some all talent shows. No, it was, I did do musical theater in elementary school. And I remember doing a play at, I believe it was either the Fox Theater or the Rialto, but it was like an African wedding. I didn't mm-hmm. get to sing though, but I was in it. Um, and that was like the bug. That was like, I see a, it's a full audience. Okay. If I was Carrie now, I might've just went rogue. Right. (laughs) 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 Um, I, I, let me see. When do I feel like it, like shit is real? I think for me, it was such a progression, but I think... I had a lot of moments where I felt like it's real. It's nothing but a series of moments. Uh, moment, yeah, it's yeah. a series. You got years in between them. Okay, mm-hmm. so I don't know the first one, but I remember one of the big ones was joining the group under Marvin McIntyre. Marvin McIntyre. Yeah. Yeah. That was, was a big one. How old are you at this point? They formed. I was fourteen. They formed a group around me. We were performing. We were showcasing for every label. All every. All of them. All mm-hmm. the ones I grew up reading in the credits. Yeah. All yeah. of them. Mm-hmm. And we ended up signing with Merlin Bob and um, Sylvia Roan at, at Electra. Electra. Yeah. Yeah. So um, we never came out, but like. But you got an advance. I got. I don't even think we got that oh, far. Shit. And if we did. So. Oh, shit. If we did. Mm. <clears throat> oh, shit. <clears throat> we may yeah. not have ever gotten it. I didn't get to y'all. It got to somebody. <laughs> it got to somebody. <laughs> it got it. <laughs> 
<laughs> no. I think it was actually a demo deal. I think it was a demo deal. A development. Yeah, like a development got, deal. Got, got, and so we disbanded before you, you we got to that point. It's a, there's a development budget, too, though. <laughs> oh, well, There's budgets yeah. for all the budgets for everything. You, what you say? You ain't got you still ain't the royalties it. for Hoochie Coochie Man? <laughs> um, Hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> so... So that, that was a, that was a but, but that made you feel like but that's a real thing you know? okay. yeah and yeah. I started writing then too for the group so oh, I was were, writing oh, our, oh. the songs that we would perform oh, sure. years okay. in yeah. first mm-hmm. we were doing covers of course mm-hmm. yeah. um, and then I remember this is wasn't my first taste of writing because I had a guy I went to church with who had tracks and he was an ass he was signed to ASCAP and you know what I mean he was kind of in the mix his name was Terrence shout out to Terrence mm-hmm. um, and he would give me CDs at church of instrumentals. So I'm like, finally, I could like write to something other than a song, like me having to erase the arrangement and the singing on top. You know what right, I'm saying? Like right. I had to imagine the tracks were instrumentals, yeah. mm-hmm, but I was yeah. writing whole new songs over them. Um, and, and that was, I was successful at being able to do that, which is now I think it informs the way that I create now because I can really isolate. You know what I mean? Got you. Yeah. yeah. So anyway, you're like a walking um, stem player. <laughs> yeah, I guess. that's great. They, they gave it a name. That's great. Okay. Yes. Uh, I can do that with voices too. Like, I somebody could be talking in a room, and I'm like, I didn't hear a word you said. Oh shit. A word. That's good it's, and bad. It's, it's good. <laughs> that's good. Yeah. That's good and bad. That's good and bad. Yeah. I I do that, um, but it's hyper focus. So it's hyper. If I'm hyper focused on something, I could. Oh yeah, yeah. You zone out. I, no, I'm yeah, gone. Yeah, I guess sure. that means I'm hyper focused. I accidentally I stepped on like... a baby. <laughs> oh man! Your baby or a baby? A well, this is my family member. They, they're still alive. They grew up. They're fine. But <laughs> like full step. <laughs> like uh, stomped out. And full weight up. by accident. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. He had a whoop this trick moment. What is going on? Man? Prince was on TV. Oh, and it was my first time oh, ever no. seeing and hearing Prince. It was a full step. And it was so, a full stop. Oh, yeah, yeah, and yeah. so for me as a kid, things would things would hit my brain like and stimulate me in a way that I didn't understand, and I would completely be lost. Oh, and I I, I was just it. I remember walking towards the TV mm. and it was like dearly beloved. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I hope it wasn't a dance. I hope you weren't. You no, didn't break okay. out. No, I, and I just... I, 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 when I, Dove got... Just kind of... It's a full on I just kind of stepped on the baby. Kind of. Yeah. And I remember um, Monty screaming, I move. And I'm like, what? The, what? I look at his baby right now. He said, you stepped on the baby. I was like, Infant. I, I, I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to. Oh. And so... Um, I can zone out. That's yeah. the point of the okay. story. Yeah, Especially the, when music is involved. Yeah, I remember yeah, those. Yeah. Y'all remember those moments? I Gone. Remember them moments. Yeah. Like you can scare me. Like if I'm zoned out, you could scare the shit out of me. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like yeah. my kids have done it. Mm. Daddy, what's the, stop fucking around. Stop <laughs> 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 fucking around. So <laughs> before he's stepping on babies, <laughs> now you're writing songs. Yeah, I was writing songs. So I was getting tracks and da da da. And then it turned into writing for the group and that was real because he was like well he put us all in separate rooms and he said here's a track I got mm-hmm. I want to see what y'all can do but right? you had already I had writing. years yeah I had yeah. years yeah. Like this. oh yeah, yeah I got this I smashed real yeah, fast yeah real fast yeah. real fast y'all I, not like me they were coming in the room like are you done are you done I was like yeah I'm done do you have all the parts yeah I got the harmonies you know what I mean it's fully written yeah he was like I'm, I'm stuck I was like Okay. But they had never really Lord, done it. I got it. I got you. But they yeah. had never really done they it. They had never really done it. And it's yeah. not a Do you still easy know the thing, girls from that group? I, re- I reacquaint with them, or one of them, really, from that group. Um, really only once in, what has it been, 30 years? Okay. okay. Not 30 years, 25. Okay. But on the bad way, just everybody went to separate Yeah, no, yeah. One, well, yeah, actually... Yeah. Yeah, they went as separate as ways could go. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. You remember the name of the group? By Design. By Design. By Design. Yeah. Give it up One for became, By Design. 
No. <laughs> I know. I didn't really like the I did, I did not like the name. Nope. I didn't like the name. We're not clapping. <laughs> Don't ever let her bring that back. If she signs the group, I know what I'm going to call y'all. My uh, design. <laughs> no, we're not doing that. <laughs> I, I didn't like the name. But one became, one ended up stripping and one became the already, minister already, of music. Yeah. I already Church. knew one became, I just. Okay, so that you said that, when you did this, I said, okay, somebody was on the pole. Yeah. Oh. She's yeah. still there now? Hope not. You know, Magic City got the best Impossible Burger in town. Man, what? (laughs) What? (laughs) Nothing. Um, Nobody goes to Magic City for the Impossible Burger tank. Yes, we do. I mean. Yes, we do. Apparently they do. Yes, we do. Okay. That Impossible Burger at Magic? Shout out to Magic. I'm just talking to Lulu about that. We was on the phone. (laughs) He's like, like, you been to Magic City yet? I said, no, but the Impossible Burger is calling me. All right. So, anyway. Y'all, this group, you're writing. Uh-huh. Does anybody hear that? Like, hear these songs from this group and identify you as as the writer, as the yes. singular yes. talent that... Anthony Dent was one of them. Mm-hmm. Shout out to my I... Bay Area partner. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Yeah. 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 He was one of them. Focus. Mm-hmm. Um, Teddy Bishop. Ooh, yeah. These are so people... So it started getting around. It started kind of, like, yeah. Like, okay, there's, there's this girl. There's this... Yeah. There's this teenager. Mm-hmm. And she's also in college. So you're in college by now, though? I'm in college at this point. Okay. Yeah. Because I was age? in the group from 14 to... I went to college at 17. I think we disbanded at 18. Yeah. 14 so, to 18. How fast did you get in another group? Because I met you yeah. when you were in a group. Yeah. Uh, it happened faster than I wanted it to. Because okay. I wanted to work on Carrie. Mm-hmm. But then... Then I started writing for those people and more, mm-hmm. right? Um, when the group disbanded, and Dent had the idea to again put a group around me. It's not what I wanted, but I said I'll give you a little time on this, and I gave him a little time on it. And I met and we you during that time. And we did, yeah. and you met me during yeah. that time. What was the name of that group? So I was nineteen, I think, or tw- maybe it's, it might have been a couple of years. But- Nah. I don't think I was 20 yet, yeah. Nah, you weren't 20 yet. That was Pretty Tony. Now, I like that name. You came front on Pretty Tony. very player. I mean, it was four girls, and then we added a, a fifth. It's a, it's a nigga from Oakland <laughs> naming his group after a nigga in the Mac named yes. Pretty Tony. Yeah. I know exactly yeah, what Yeah, and his name is Anthony, was. so then there's that. But, yeah. like, and Pretty his Tony. Name is Anthony. Pretty and we Tony. were bad. We these were are, cute. These, these are the Pretty Tonys. Give it up, give it up Do you for remember Pretty the Tony. Group? You know what? It's not. No. Mm-hmm. I remember saying to Dent. Okay. I said, group is cool. Her. Mm. Mm. Her ended up being you. you. Mm-hmm. Wow. This was just my assessment mm-hmm. of yeah. it. You know what I'm saying? And, and at that point, I'm the super young nigga in the industry. I done got me some little records. I'm cracking. Yeah, I, yeah. you know, I got my placements and shit, and I'm moving around you New were York, with him Atlanta. As a writer. I was, meeting, was, I was meeting with him as my partner. Oh, I see. You know what okay, I'm saying? Okay. Because of Your our OG. mutual friend Copy Shakir that. Stewart. Oh, right. So mm-hmm. Dent, like, man, I need you. Valentine, I need you to come by, man. I got these girls. You know, I'm 20, 21 years, whatever I am at the time. I'm like, hey, you got you. You said you got you girls, girls over there. Yeah. I'll come. Yeah. I'll, I'll yeah. come see what you got over there, baby. Like, we were around the same age. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. 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 I, I got me a little bag already. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, I'm coming. Yeah. And then, you know, okay. I met you. So I Shakira met was group. there too then. Yeah. Because Shakira Shakir. was very instrumental mm-hmm. in like setting up our showcases mm-hmm. for yep. Dent, you know, yeah. for the group. For and the I was kind of, I was quietly wow. a bit of a tastemaker for them, especially okay. for Shakir. Okay. Because I was younger than them. Yeah. So it was like, if yeah. our young partner, yeah. who really out here, mm-hmm. really moving around, if he fuck with it, it's something. That, like that's how they looked at me. Like they, yes. without me even being an actual A and R, wow, I was kind of like the yeah. consultant yeah. that wasn't getting paid. I was mm-hmm. getting paid in the parties and shit that yeah. he was going to. Paid. But yeah, <laughs> I was I was hanging out with the homies. And how long did this group last? It's a good question. Um, I don't feel like that lasted long. Nah, yeah, it was a couple years though. Was it? It was a couple years for sure. It was at least two, I guess. Yeah. Shit. Because remember, we start writing after that. Not yeah. very long after that. I might have still been in the group when I was, because I was writing also. That's when I started 
Jonte Austin took me up under his wing yeah. while I was in great the group. Wing. That was that Just was a, a great wing. wing. Mm-hmm. Great wing. So he was like yeah. Dent. I would say was my first songwriting mentor, and then mm-hmm. Jonte like as a actual songwriter. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. It's a great wing. Great he bought wing. me my first. He taught me how to cover my throat. Bought me my first scarf. Of course he of bought course you he a bought scarf. scarf. <laughs> Jonte. <laughs> Yeah, um, so it, 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 go over there right there <laughs> and um, go go open that drawer right there. It's 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 some things in there. <laughs> it's, it's, grab your scarf. Grab your scarf. scarf. Grab, grab, one <laughs> grab one that fits you. Grab one of those. Grab one that fits you. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Yeah. He taught me so much though about like <clears throat> about just formatting and, and arranging and just, just I just got to watch. He brought me in real on songwriting. Some, real songwriting. Yeah, and he brought me in on his sessions and before long, because I'm a, I can't, like I said, I I do everything what? At least good. Well. Well. Yeah. I'm going to, I put effort, like, it's that trait. hmm So, like, I catch on quick. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. And that's, I just, God was, looking back, God was placing me in every scenario that I needed to become who I became. Right. To grab all those tools. Yes. Grab all that information. Just, yep. Collecting tools for the yeah. toolbox. I don't know when or how I'm going to need them, yep. but I know I'm going to need them. Yep. Yeah, at some point. Yeah, because I'm sure you guys... I wonder... You know how... I never questioned. It was never a doubt in my mind that I wouldn't have become famous. hmm I knew really, really, really young. Did you know? I didn't know what famous I knew. was. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> like, I didn't, I didn't know... I didn't know what that meant. I know that was a thing. I was just, I just wanted to sing. Okay. I just wanted to be, I just wanted to be like John P. Key. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Um, and just, you know, and, and sing at church. Mm. And that's that's all I knew. Like, even when I saw it on TV, I was like, oh, that's cool. Like, but I'd never say, oh, I want to be on TV. I never, I never said that. Okay. Yeah. So Listen. you're saying your world was like just so far from secular It was so far from any of that. You know okay. what I'm saying? Like, I was just, it was just... If if they standing up shouting in church, mm-hmm. that That's was enough. the height for me. That was like that was like oh like oh I'm here I arrived this is it. yeah <laughs> I arrived yeah I, I never I mean to this day I don't I don't even consider myself ever being famous I, I don't think I've ever been famous in my life so for me I I look at it like mm, you're up there I ran yeah. from being mm-hmm. famous mm-hmm. like you said I always thought yeah. it would happen mm-hmm. and I was like I don't want it. Mm. Mm. I just want to go shopping and shit. <laughs> I just want to be able to enjoy my money. So I got to get me some money. <laughs> shopping and go shit. Shopping so shit. I can go. Like, that's what. Oh, my to God. This that day, sounds stay fresh. so Bay Area. So no, no. To this fresh. day, you will right. catch me in somebody's department store. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Boutique. Yeah. Oh, my God. That's where you will run into me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. If you want to find me. Mm-hmm. If your city got a fly boutique or some cool ass shoes somewhere, be there. that's where I'm gonna be. But that's okay. all I for me. That's what I wanted. I didn't. I never. I knew fame was going to come if I did certain things. Mm. So I wouldn't do that. So you did what you wouldn't do. I wouldn't do them. He, so I'm on like, purpose oh no, too. you did the I'm like, opposite of pursuing I'm like, oh, it. No, on yeah. purpose. I'm like famous. Like, you know famous what? If I keep doing that, that, I'm gonna get famous. Yeah. No, on, fuck that. on purpose and on <laughs> no, my nerves. That. Backtrack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, okay. that's why guys like Al Jamal hate me. He's like, nigga, just go do your thing, shit, nigga. You know, <laughs> nigga, if you just do your thing. Al Jamal. Yeah, you both. You knew you what? had it. Hey, hey, what you doing? Al Jamal, right. Big Jason. Nigga. Oh, my God. All niggas that want to fight you, too. You got all the stuff. Y'all, the niggas want to fight you and you beat you up and shit. Like, nigga, give me a voice, nigga, so I can go do the shit for you. Give me the hair, give me the voice. But you saw was that... <laughs> I'm now I'm becoming the damn interviewer. Hey, that works. But I feel it's like I, this is yours. I'm curious because you, you guys are my friends. Yeah, this is I feel like we're just talking in the yeah. studio. But did you think that what you saw your family go through or your brothers like um, that group? Like, do you feel like getting that taste of it when you were that young had anything to do with running from it? I don't like to be bothered. Oh, okay. I like to eat in peace. <laughs> I like to walk through the airport in peace. Okay. 
I don't I don't mm-hmm. want the TSA girl to be like, I see you. <laughs> <laughs> Which is the podcast is fucking made that. Ooh. I'm like, oh, are you, you fly, are you flying first class? Because I know you don't like to pay for the first class ticket. Yeah. I'm like, I, I, yeah. She's watching. She's you watching. Got, <laughs> nigga, you got your blanket? I'm like, you got your blanket. I have, you got your blanket. I have my blanket. Yes. Yeah. I have, Hilarious. But I, for me, like, yeah. I just, yeah. I, I like... I like being normal. Mm. I like normal life. I just want None. the money that come along with okay. y'all famous life. Once I got a taste of it, <laughs> need it. <laughs> How do I stay famous? How do I stay How famous? <laughs> famous? <laughs> Once the nigga that was doing security for me <laughs> wouldn't let me in the club because I wasn't that Wait. famous no more, Ooh. I said, Oh, no, 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 no. This has never happened again. No, no, no. I got to be famous at all times. Okay. That's right. At all times. I need the access. I at least need the options. Yeah. At all times. Yeah. Even if I don't want to partake. Yeah. Mm-hmm. If, if I they need don't the know motherfucking options. Option. If they don't the know me at the option, front door, the I don't, and I'm not getting in, and I don't access. know somebody there, I'm just going to go home. I don't care. Like, don't bother me. Yeah. Like, I was sick. Nigga. Oh, y'all full tonight? That's cool. I didn't really want to be here anyway. I didn't want to be here. Are you sure? <laughs> That's me. Sure? Are you sure? It's a, it's a little room. <laughs> Somebody. It's me, dog. Just, who, who all got a section? Let me. Who got a section? Let me call, oh, Let me call somebody. <laughs> Fox, what you doing? You in there right now? <laughs> it's too many? I'm going to wait at the house. All right. Y'all hear me? When, all right. All right. Sick. Was that guy? So you knew, you knew fame was in the cards for yes. you? Some way. Did yeah. you know it as an artist it, or what, did you see it as like, I'm going to be a no, famous singer? No, as an singer. artist. As yes. an artist. So the groups to me, I kind of felt like they are in my way. Why does this keep happening? So Why people they, keep putting me in groups. Did this you also in, in, in the back of your mind know that it wasn't going to work in a group? Yes. Huh. The back and the front. Hmm. Wow. It's that bullshit. <laughs> you, you just passing time in a sense because you like this opportunity. I was like, hmm. Develop relationships. And that's when the idea to cultivate songwriting happened it was just like that's a waste of my that's a waste of my time but this ain't hmm. you found and purpose within there, that yeah within like, what you thought I was a waste of time yeah I was like you, yeah. well, while I'm in this space yeah. I can develop this yes got you yes got you so I was spreading the board like and knowing that it was possible that someone we would showcase for would just be like I like her yeah 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 I knew that was a possibility. No, that was absolutely. And it did happen. Yeah, it was, it was happening. Absolutely. That was happening. <laughs> it did happen. Okay, so when, so when do you break free? <clears throat> I broke free, excuse me. <clears throat> um, college allowed me the first opportunity to break free. Um, even though we were in a deal. that This is the first group by design. The second group, uh, I don't know, but I'm sure I concocted a plan and f- carried it through, and I was successful at to it. Get out. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Exit plan. <It's> diabolical. <laughs> <laughs> I've been there. I'm sure yeah, that's how it happened. I, no, I don't I've, remember I've been there. I, I get what it. I chose. Okay, but I'm sure I had some ideas and I carried I'm them out. out. I'm getting out of this shit. <laughs> pull this fire alarm. Yeah, I'm going to pull this fire alarm. <laughs> just going to start running. They're not as fast as me. You're not as fast as me. I'm going to get out the building. I'm going to get out the building oh, before damn, I blow up. Oh, damn, I didn't want to kill him. <laughs> Jesus, Jay. <laughs> not literally. Not literally. But, uh, yeah, yeah but, but it makes yeah. sense. Yeah. So when do you get your first... Hit record then as a as a first writer. Hit record as a writer. Okay, hit first hit. Or even just I placement. can't play that game. First placement. placement. I remember my okay. first placement. Okay. Um, no, I'm lying. The first one I got a check for was Re- Ruben Stutter. For the first album, for his first album, his his first album. Um, I think that's the first one that paid. I don't remember. I remember the like the group of first. I was working. Listen, bruh. I was doing two or three occasional four sessions a day. Like, you know how they do in L.A. now Mm -hmm. where the writer goes two hours here and then two hours. They could work an eight-hour day, Mm -hmm. but they've been with four or five producers throughout that time. Yeah, that's you. That was me. In Atlanta. And I had school. In Atlanta where nothing is And my school was like an hour away. Shit. Yes. 
Exactly. Oh, he was, Nothing yeah. was close. So that was me then. This is what? T- 2000. Uh, I graduated in 2000, so it would have been like, I guess, 02, 03 ish. Yeah. And that was that. No, I can attest to that. Mm-hmm. Mm. I come to Atlanta, and Carrie's like, she's come by the crib. I'm like, all right, cool. She's like, we're going to write. Carrie knew how to work her mm-hmm. little Pro Tools set up. <laughs> like, she really knew how yeah. to get through all the shit. It yeah. was like me going to one of the other homies' mm-hmm. spots, and, you know, I had always had my home studios, and I had my different stuff, too. And I'm like, oh, she on her shit. Yeah, yeah. I actually enjoy writing and working with her. Because, right. you know, we all know this. We've all, male or female, mm-hmm. you get to some people and you're just like, yo, how are you even in the music business? Right. Mm. You don't know what the fuck you're doing. Right. 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 <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, and I'm going to call this engineer, man. And, oh, this nigga ain't got here yet. And, and like, by this time, nigga, I'm trying to go to Papa Do's. Right. Okay. Like, I'm trying to get up out of here, bro. Yeah, like, nigga, you part. wasn't ready. It wasn't. I went to Carrie's house and I was like, oh, she gets it. Yeah. I was like, she fucking gets it. Like, mm-hmm. she is on top of her shit. She's not wasting no time. She's not playing around. We were, we're going to, and we did, and write we a did song. Yeah. A record, we, you know what I'm yes. saying? Like, mm-hmm. yeah. <laughs> that's something that we all shoot for. We all writers and producers, yeah. and like, yeah. we've all been there. Yeah. You want to finish some shit. Yes. Yeah. You want to write some shit. Yes. And you want it to be great. You want it to be great. Yeah. Every time. So, yeah, Let's I, I, I saw it. Let's I write saw the hook. Let's, we, we were. I had a futon. This was like upstairs. Yeah, it was upstairs. It was upstairs. At the house that I stayed in during college. And I just turned upstairs to this blue, I call it the blue room, but it was just my studio. And had my Pro Tools rig, mic. That was what I did with my first check, was bought everything I needed. Oh, to so be she able answered to, the question. To do she this because you knew that was coming. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I wanted to know what she did with that yeah. check. Yeah, that's what the I blue did. Room. I mean, I bought a car too. Hey. I bought a, oof, that thing was cold. I bought, the first car I bought myself was a BMW 330 CIC. So I had the convertible. Mm, okay. And it was this, you probably remember. Uh, yeah, like, I'm going to let you explain it. Okay. Yeah, yeah. But it was this graphite color that looked one way when you look at one <laughs> angle, then looked a different way when you looked a different angle. You know what I mean? It was that. It was fly. It was fly. It was like a purpley gray Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You know, like a periwinkle kind depends, of you know, dolphin I mean, depends gray. Depends on how the light hit it. Yeah, it depends on how they yeah. it was. It was everything yeah. in the gray spectrum with a little purple in it. Yeah. A little feminine. You, know you felt what good mean? about that. Oh you still God. feel good about it. Yeah. <laughs> she, nigga, she yeah. can't even oh, I, keep her. I, I, I loved I loved that car. But did you have a car. publishing deal? <clears throat> or, I didn't do it. No, no. You hadn't done a publishing oh, no, deal or anything I waited, yet. I waited almost a decade to do a publishing deal. Oh, wow. Just about. Not really. I didn't wait a decade. Um... I don't remember what year I did that, but I know it was a lot of offers for a long time. I'm sure. It was at least maybe, could have been 10 from the moment, from the first check to the time when I, it was about that, maybe eight eight or nine years. I Mm -hmm. waited. I waited. I stacked up. I had singles on the radio, stacked up. I was like, "Uh," because everybody kept saying, you know. There was this thing about having records in the pipeline, and that's when publishing companies are interested in you. I was like, well, let me see what they do when I got them on the radio. Yeah. I just felt like that. You know yeah. what I mean? Like Very I was smart move. Yeah. She also had the cheat code, too, though. How, what was the cheat code? Ethiopia, who was in well, publishing. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, so it was kind of like... Well, actually, no, I didn't know her that whole way. <laughs> no? I didn't know. Polo introduced me to Ethiopia. Oh. And when I was when artist pursuing yeah, yeah, okay, okay. my okay. artist yeah, stuff. Yes. 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 So I ended up there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But no, I turned down a whole lot. We ain't gonna name them, name no names. Right. But all the like heavy no, ones, heavy everybody ones, everybody heavy yeah. ones, heavy ones. No, once you get I was like, records, mm. once you get records on albums or singles yeah. out, every single publisher is coming. They're coming. Yeah, they're yeah. coming, and they are. And it a lot of it was laughable because at that point, like I knew, you remember the Donald Passman book, all you need yeah. to know about mm-hmm. the music business, yeah. of and like between that and the relationships that I had cultivated over those over those years like I would ask questions I would research I would look it up I would mm. you know what I mean I, I knew I wanted to be really really wise with these permanent decisions because I I knew what a deal blowing up looked like mm-hmm. you know what I mean yeah so didn't want to be there again right so no nah, I'm gonna wait I waited a long time 
I didn't know that. I thought you had done it, but I thought you had about years. Of That's great, though. So many. Yeah. I think it was like, I would say between seven and nine years. Patience. Yeah, patience. But you know, I think the way that circumstances were lined up, lining up for me. No, let me not even say that because that sounds passive. The way that I was lining shit up and hustling this shit out. Right. Right. Was providing me the. The means to the means to be able to wait, to, hold, yeah. to hold out, yeah. yeah, to hold out. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's the tough part about a holdout. Yeah, you got it, oh, man. Yeah, you better have something to hold out with. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Home Depot. I don't care what it is. You got to have <laughs> yeah. something right to hold out uh-huh. with yeah. some type of foundational yeah. income. Mm-hmm. But I mean, those checks started turning around early. Those performance checks started turning around early for you. So that's I didn't I didn't think of that. I got my part. They, they wouldn't even let me leave without doing a publishing deal. I got what? my publishing deal, Man, record deal, all at the same time. Oh, wow. Here you okay. go. Okay. Here you go. <laughs> all of it? Yeah, everything. everything. <clears throat> but here's the money. Did you get an additional check for that? Yes, or no? sir. Okay. 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 You, some all niggas right. don't get an additional. They separated Listen, it. Some niggas don't get an additional. Yeah. You'd be like, this is. I got, I got 75000 Advance for my artists and okay. one twenty five advance for my publishing. Mm. Two hundred ninety eight. Two hundred. Mm. So you're out the groups. Uh huh. With an S. Mm-hmm. Right. Mm-hmm. The groups. Yeah. And thank God you're writing songs. I mean, I love y'all girls, but I had other plans. Yeah, I get it. And you're writing songs. You now you start placing songs. Mm-hmm. Is that burning desire there as you're giving your songs away? As, mm. as like, I'm an artist. I want to sing these songs. Yeah, it was a tinge. I would say it, it was like a little, like a little, <sighs> I got to produce vocals. I got to arrange this record and I got to record and I got to edit. So I had to sit there and like really, sometimes it was like a, like a nuisance. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, I want to, I want to do that. But because I was able to demo the records and I was able to, um, do all the same things I had to do for them for myself. Mm-hmm. I was satisfied. It wasn't that it wasn't overwhelming my desire. You know what I mean? At that time, I was like, and I knew I was capable. Like, I'll just do some more. Yeah. Mm. I never felt like if I don't have that, I'll never ma- like, yeah, I'll do it tomorrow. Mm-hmm. I'll do another one next week. We just keep keep it. Keep it going. Right. Just keep it going. Right. But I won't say that it would never occur to me like where I, it, 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 that itch was there for sure. Yeah, where well, you heard your demo and then you heard what they did and you were like, I Yeah, know. it was some, oh, it was definitely some of those. <sighs> it was definitely some of those. Like, oh my God. Every why, writer. Why did had it go moment. there? Yeah, yeah. Every, every writer. Yeah, you go through that. that. The writer who can yeah. really sing. Right. Yeah. You just see what I'm saying? You'd be like, Man, like, damn, bro. Like, why'd you switch that part? That part feels that good. Was the, that was the part. That, yeah, was, that was the yeah, yeah, yeah. That was the money. Yeah, yeah, I was, I just was, trust I, I was me, in my bro. bag on that part. I got extra saucy right there. Yeah. And when you yeah. don't get to be, remember when it stopped being able, when songwriters, we stopped being able to fly in to mm-hmm. cut records on people. They wanted to cut it with their engineer. They wanted yeah. to, it started, yeah. there was this separation yeah, that was happening sure. where it was like, yep. I, I can't, what you mean I can't be there? Can't fully see it through. Yeah, like, yeah, that sucked. Yeah, it sucked. It okay. sucked because people did what they wanted. They changing hooks. They might, you know, whole new B section when you hear it back. It's just to have publishing gotta, on it, smile. and it ain't flying. <laughs> yeah, it's just it's like, just yeah, it's great. <laughs> mm-hmm. What's the laugh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ron Fair did that to me. So. <laughs> <laughs> she, she, <laughs> tampered with my beat on a Keisha Cole record. Oh. I was like, what? Ron Fair. Why did he do that? Can he do that? And he, was, and, and he was the president of the label. <laughs> yeah, I was like, it's the I was only like, way it was gonna make it. Oh, he shouldn't do that. <laughs> they like it for the first single. All right, okay, <laughs> all right. Okay. Well, hmm? if you want some you changes, hundred, if you, it's what we call I'm a hundred percent. Yeah. If you hear something, you can call me. Yeah, suggest mm-hmm. it to me and suggest and tell me. Facts. I hear Facts. and I can be like, you know what? I hear what you hear too. I'm gonna put it on there. Yeah. But yeah. well, he took it upon himself yeah. to put strings without on without, to, to without put, even a mention. Like, hey, they, I'm gonna. Ain't even holler at me. Yeah. Right. I was man, like, man, that's that's crazy. That's crazy what you did to the record. <clears throat> it's great, right? I was like, oh. yeah. <laughs> Again, Shit. he's the president. <laughs> he's the Tank, damn it president. Tank ain't like what you did to his record, man. No, I, at first I didn't, and then I grew to like it. I grew, I grew to, to like love it, it Ron. It, Thanks. 
So when do you get to polo? When do I get to polo? How get, does that happen? Um, I was a writer. I remember passing him at some session I was doing. I think he was leaving and I was coming or I was leaving and he, no, I was leaving and he was coming. Mm -hmm. We passed each other in the front. He was like, hey, a little birdie told me you were dope. And I said, okay. So I, you know, was leaving. And he, I want to say he, our group ended up performing at this stadium at the same, our group and his group, uh, mm. uh, Jim Crow. Jim Crow. Oh, I got you. Remember Jim Crow. Yes. Yeah. So yeah. then we got to know each other. I can't remember which order this happened. I think it was Birdie told me you're dope first. And then, or at some point, I don't know. Maybe the group performance happened. For, I don't know. It's all, you know, mm -hmm. y'all know how it be. But those two events happened. And so this is how I knew Polo. Because mm -hmm. I think, um, I remember going outside that session. I want to say the conversation engaged. Like I was just, at first I was like, oh, okay, that's, you know, that's nice. I didn't know really what, why, or who. But he had an idea and he, and he walked outside with me or walked me to my car, I think, and was like, Um, something about Tim, like he made it like he was working with Timbaland on something, right? I didn't really believe him, but that was it. And then I was working one night with Donnie Scantz. Mm -hmm. Donnie Scantz. Scantz. The Scantz. Scantleberry. Oh my God. Yeah. yeah. D Scantz. So he, um, we did a lot of, we actually were about to do a prop. We were doing kind of like an alternative we had a whole round of like some really dope live stuff. Mm. We performed it randomly uh, once, I think. <laughs> mm. But anyway, so we were working. And so one night he asked me and he's like, Who, if somebody were, if somebody, where would you, I'm trying to remember if that was Donnie or Polo, because both of them happen outside by a car. You know, you're the girl. People walk you out and make sure everything's yeah. safe, whatever. Yeah. One of them says, who would you want to be with as an artist? If you were thinking, because they both, everybody at that point knew that I wasn't vocal about pursuing the artist thing. Carrie is a songwriter. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She's an arranger. She's mm -hmm. producing your vocals. She's engineering your session. She's doing the rough mix. She's, you know what I mean? That's how every, that was that's everyone's really dope, awareness too, of me. Yeah, that's yeah. dope. Um, so this guy says, whichever one it was, Polo or Donnie says, if you were an artist, who do you think would get your music? And I say, Timbaland, hands down. You never met Tim at this point? I never met him. Yeah. And it, it wasn't long before... Somebody made Timbaland aware of me. And I don't believe that it was Polo. I feel like it was Donnie. Maybe Donnie told Polo I said that mm -hmm, or mm -hmm. something. You know what I mean? I don't, yeah. I don't remember how it happened, but it wasn't very long. It couldn't have been more than a year where Tim comes in town and... You meet with him? I meet with him at a hotel. It's early morning. I was fresh off vacation. I had these like dread things, like these locks in my hair. Vacation braids. Vacation mm -hmm. hair. Yeah, yeah, yes, yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. You girls never want to go on vacation with your... With your everyday hair. <laughs> Go ahead. It's a black so you, girl thing. So you, so you take your interview with your vacation right. break. <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> and at that same studio loft that we, you and I worked on in, um, I, I, and I had just gone to bed. I had just gone to bed. This is that thing about being ready, being prepared. I had just gone to bed at like 6 or 7 in the morning. So I'm surprised that I even answered the phone call. Normally, after a session, when I'm... <laughs> when I'm done mm -hmm. especially if it's we're getting in I'm, I got in, in in the morning I just happened to answer the phone like just in case something was wrong and it was I was finishing up a record with Poe I think it was Pimpin' All Over the World I remember doing that song oh, at the yeah, student yeah, studio yeah, yeah. you did that yeah, you yeah. Did that I'm pretty I'm sure I know we did that song Pimpin at that studio and I didn't world. work <clears throat> right, it was I'm pretty sure it was that same day and because um, we did Pippin' All the World, Runaway Love, oh. during the yeah. same yeah. session. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. at the same spot. So 
we had just gone to bed, and I'm just thinking he just want to say something. Like, I had literally just hopped in. Again, it's like, I would say around seven. Hey. Hey. Uh, Timbaland is in town, and uh, he wants to meet you. I say, when? He said, at like 9, 9.30. I was like. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, this is it. So instead of going to sleep, I go upstairs. I put together a demo. I press the little thing. You know how you, you write this? No, I printed the song titles and then I put the sticker on the CD. Mm -hmm. like, oh, you had the full thing. Okay. Well, I had never thought. I It had been years, kind of, since I had pursued being an artist mm -hmm. yeah. or even said it to anybody you yeah. know what I mean you're like, gonna present it right now yeah yeah, 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 yeah. but I'm gonna do that yeah you know what I mean yeah so I put together a CD of a few of I guess maybe I think had four songs on each side so probably eight songs um put my name I just went to and then I got dressed went to the hotel and played songs that I've written for other people that I was like I guess if I were an artist this it's is what I would sound like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, let me try to make this cohesive and put them in order, sequence it like mm -hmm, it's a project. Mm -hmm, like, mm -hmm. you know, so that's what I did. And what'd he say? Bounce records down. What'd he say? What'd he say? <clears throat> Tim said, oh, I know what to do with this. I know what to do with this. So he says, and I played him records. <clears throat> there was one record that he really liked, and he said, that's your Cry Me a River. And I said, shit. shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And it was. It was a song I did with Dan, uh, Donnie called Strange Angel. And it was alternative sounding, but it had enough of a cadence that I knew exactly what Tim, I was like, oh, shit. Mm -hmm. I could hear that. Mm -hmm. I could hear that. I sang mm -hmm. real, I was singing really soft, you know what I mean, over some... A, a rhythm so anyway so he says those two things that I'll never forget I know what to do with you I know what to do with this meaning this yeah. meaning you yeah, yeah. right and then that's your cry me a river I'm like god damn I manifested yeah. this shit right, I didn't right. even know that word back then right. I didn't say that yeah. but I was like that was one of my first awarenesses of God because I spoke that mm -hmm. I spoke that someone maybe a year or whatever before it's like if you could be with one producer, one pro and I remember really giving it some thought because there were listen, I'm a babyface fan, mm -hmm. you know yeah. what I mean? It was a lot of people I could have chosen from Teddy Riley. It was a lot of people that I really appreciated who yeah. were you know produce and I I landed on Timbaland after giving that some real. This was a, it wasn't a quick conversation. It was like I I don't like to answer things uh, inauthentically, so and then you land with Timbaland. But I land with Timbaland. And then he's like, hey, so what are you doing tonight? I was like, I had sessions, but I said nothing. <laughs> Everything's, <laughs> Everything's canceled. canceled. <laughs> Everything's canceled. <laughs> Call I everyone. All this shit's canceled. <laughs> Tell them I'm unavailable. I said nothing. And in hey, the back of my head home? was like. Your mom home? <laughs> put your mom on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> that. Uh, um, yeah. In the back of my mind, I was like, shh. You asking me what I'm doing? It's not a damn thing. Yeah, nothing is going to be more important than whatever the fuck you're about to ask me. We're about you want to do. Yeah. Um. And so he said, "Can you come to Miami?" I was like, "Oh, I didn't expect that." <laughs> 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 oh, we talking um, boss talk. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hey, I said we, uh, whatever I was doing wasn't here tonight. Yeah, it's somewhere it's, else. Yeah. <laughs> she thought we gonna. Are you here. ready? Are you ready to go? You get your backpack. Mm -hmm. I love that's, it. Flight was at three o'clock. I love it. That's high level. I love it. Flight was at three o'clock. Yeah. Are you are you ready? You are said you, you ready? I know you got ready. Yeah. To come over here. Yeah. But are you ready? Yeah. You go to Miami. And I was ready that I day. I go that day, hours after the meeting. Yeah, right. And you still ain't slept. Still ain't slept. Fuck the and sleep. And we went straight to the studio and we worked on that record. And I stayed at his house. Uh did I stay at his house? I can't remember the first trip I think so. I mean, his house is so damn big. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It was like being a ho in a hotel room. Yeah. Um, yeah. I think so. Because it wasn't any time to think. It was at his house. It was cold as hell. 
God, Tim used to keep his house so cold. I bet he still does. And that polar bear life. Oh, it was miserable. I was miserable, but 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 I was on such a cloud nine. Yeah. Oh, I was. We went straight in and worked on that record you that I had just that played. You wouldn't tell him that you was cold in. at the house. He was like, it's, it's fine. So I'm just gonna be in here cold. Just walking this bubble. <laughs> I was telling other people. I was telling other <laughs> people. Are you cold? Are you not, you're not cold. Okay. He's <laughs> like, gotta ask. Yeah. You know what else cold? cold? Yeah, but immediately it was like this brother sister. Mm-hmm. You know how you just meet people yeah. and you just know. We were meant to create something together absolutely something yeah. Yeah. yeah it was that and so it was that the, like you lock in with Tim mm-hmm. you, you got the writing going on with Polo mm-hmm. and once you meet Tim I'm sure you're anticipating that it's time it's about it's to real now yeah. I'm, I'm this getting is what ready you've been be waiting for the artist that I all, I've always known I was going to be first yeah. talent show yeah does that happen immediately or is there some time and maybe some frustration in between? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Speak on it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. About what? I would say... Now, mind you, first or second night I was in Miami, we were offered a million-dollar deal. Second uh, night. What's his name that was at Atlantic? Uh, Peter Edge. Peter Edge. Yeah. Peter. He Pizza was there Lynch. doing some things with, uh, Tim was working on some brandy joints. And um, was it Peter Edge? You said Atlantic. No, Atlantic. No, no, he That's not Peter no, Edge. Peter wasn't at Atlantic. No. If what is Atlantic, uh, Craig Common? No. It would no, be a. Uh, oh, I don't remember who it was. It was someone there for the bra- flying in just for the day, heard what okay. we were doing. He was at Atlantic. And he was over Brandy's project. So we'll figure out who that is okay. later. Okay. A white I'm sorry. Nigga, I'm sorry. Yep. I've, been, I've lived a lot of a lot different of life. lives. A lot of life. Okay. A lot of life. Mm-hmm. <laughs> um, and I hate that I can't remember that, but million dollar deal. First or second night. Like I, Tim hid me. He hid me in a room. He didn't want, you know, but the guy had already heard what we were doing. He didn't, yeah. I don't know why he reacted this way, but he was like, stay in there literally stay in I was in the lounge area and maybe because we weren't supposed to be working on anything else other than the brandy stuff like Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. (laughs) he probably was like yeah I don't want them to think that but it was Tim's studio they were probably paying but they probably (laughs) PO yes exactly (laughs) exactly he was probably supposed to be mixing or yeah yeah yeah. Yeah. but that ain't what we were doing um so I really thought it was on I, was like, I guess I really thought it was on. I was like, damn. So he told you that you got a million dollar offer. Yeah. yeah. Yyeah. He was like, hey, he forced me to let me hear some records of yours, you know, when I, whatever. And I played him and he want to do a deal with you. And he's offering you a million dollar deal. And I was like, okay. That's cool. Wow. Shit happens real fast around here. Yeah, <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. you. Had mm-hmm. you, I mean, obviously you've been a songwriter and you've yeah. been making money. Had you made a million dollars yet? Mm, I don't think I was quite at a million. I knew that I had... No. Because you hadn't done no publishing deal yet either. No. So No, I know, don't think I had You had no big that chunk no. of money like that. Nah. Right. Chunks of like... Yeah. Little pieces. Some yeah. Some 40s and 50s. Yeah. A couple 65s. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. But that's what I'm saying. So to hear that, even that number... <clears throat> And now, obviously, the, the the new artists now, you know, you hear these astronomical things off of, you know, the the, the analytics of how many streams they and whatever they got going on now, yeah. where they getting these stupid deals that they'll never pay back. Yeah. But mm-hmm. you being in the game that long to finally hear that number, that number used to be really a real mm-hmm. number. What it used to mean something? It will wake you up. Oh my god! They it won't meant- give me, wait, wait, they want to give me what? A million dollars. <laughs> you start doing your Dr. One Evil. Million. You know what I'm saying? Like, it it, it was different. Yeah. It was. It was different. It was. And I was impressed. Um, I was just happy. I just knew I had to, some work to do because I didn't have any songs as an artist, really. Mm-hmm. Like, some of the records I played were things I'd already placed. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Maybe one or two of them. But I just didn't know, really. I had. It had been years since I had even thought about what kind of artist I would I lost sight um wasn't that I didn't believe because I still knew that it would happen but I was just fully immersed 
in songwriting mm -hmm. that I are so fully, so fully, let me tell you something about this lip gloss. <laughs> it makes, it's sticky. It yeah. makes you talk funny. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it looks good, but oh just my God. <laughs> the side effects is the motherfucker. Jesus. Yeah. So, um, fully immersed. I was fully immersed in songwriting. So fully immersed that I couldn't think, I, I didn't give myself, I didn't have the bandwidth, so I had to figure it out, but I got Timbaland. So that's you got a, Timbaland. Yeah, I got Timbaland now. Mm, you know what goat. I mean? Yeah. And so Tim and Polo are talking about doing a joint venture. And I'm like, that's a pretty good combo. Even though at the time, I didn't really believe in Polo that much. It was really, Tim was the draw. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Polo was cool. He was figuring it out. His levels were real weird to me. Mm, right. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> it's just, can we like EQ that? And like, what, what it's, it was, his tracks were messy, but they, they had potential because he had oomph. Mm -hmm. Polo had a certain... yeah. Ear, and a certain gonna, ear. And he was gonna sell it. He was gonna, sell, gonna sell that. It. What? He Polo was gonna sell is it. The jump on the table that. producer yeah. executive. Facts. Like he gonna make Facts. you believe in it. If Man, you don't, y'all crazy. You crazy as hell. Y'all don't get it. You crazy as hell. Y'all don't get it. You crazy as hell. Y'all don't get it. Y'all basic. Y'all on the basic level. That Let's is that is needed in this industry. Yeah, it's needed. I yeah. say it all the time. You okay. gotta have that because mm -hmm. you can have something great in front of you. That college factor. Dame Dash. Yeah. True. You know what I mean? Start you can there. have all yeah. of those things. You yeah. can have the great artists. You can have, but someone who can sell it to people. Yeah. Mm -hmm. True. Don King it. Don he, King he it. You know what I'm saying? He, Thriller he in Manila. That. Absolutely. For sure. I, I, Absolutely. Because all Tim would do really. He, 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 yeah. he, 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 he ain't got to sell it. You know what I mean? He's not going to be the mouth. He's going to be the head now. Yes. You know. I told you. It's the shrug. It's like. Yeah. I can do this all day. I do, you know? <laughs> <laughs> he can. <laughs> and he does. And he yeah. can. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man, those times. So from that mm -hmm. point of you getting offered this million-dollar deal that you don't take yeah. to you actually getting the record deal with Interscope. Yes. How long is that? I think it was... That long? I don't know, no, but I know once I got my record deal, once I finally did it, I was shelved for four years. Shit, I do know that. Shit, four, cuatro. Yeah, so I think it was maybe maybe a year of just working on records with Tim, a year and a half before you even do the Interscope deal. Before I even do, before we even start. Really, really working on you shopping the deal. Oh, shopping a deal. Yeah. And are you still yeah. writing songs for other? And people? I was still doing that. Okay, I mm -hmm. was still yeah during so that you were time. Passing we your did time. Tony Braxton and others. Yeah, I was passing my own time, but I was also fully dedicated to like. You're like it's time. I'm with the. Yeah, but I had some yeah. records. I had with enough the, records to feel happy, but I was like I'm with the guy. Like, I'm with the. I'm with your guy. It's your boy. You right. you Dude, you do right. this. Y'all love. If you don't love me yet. You love yeah, him. I love him. Sure. Okay. Yeah. And is the is the clutch formed? And he brought me no. I, into... I think before even that, I met you during that time. Clutch time? No, no. When you were waiting, when you oh. were in that period, because I recorded, I was recording for Sex, Love, and Pain. I feel like I introduced y'all. Yeah. Did you? I feel like I introduced y'all because you told me. <laughs> Hold on, before this though, we gonna stop. And it may maybe not, but I'm, it's cloudy. But you told me, mm -hmm. I was like, he was like, wait, you, we we was talking about the underdogs mm -hmm. and the whole, you know, my time over there and that whole thing. And you were like, Tank is like my favorite. Mm -hmm. It's like one of my favorite R and B singers. I was mm -hmm. like, that's my nigga. And I feel like you and JQ had come to L A. Some point, we did. And I, but that I, was after yeah. I already knew him. You'd we already had already known. worked. You'd already worked. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah. We had already worked. Because by the time I saw you at the Edmonds building, right. it's yeah. St. Nick. With Saint, it was St. Nick. St. Nick. So I was writing yes. with St. Nick. Yeah. That's when I met you when you were in between because you were frustrated then. Yo, okay. But you were working okay. with Timlin. She was already working with Timlin at this yes. point. I guess so. You were, See, I'm you, not good you, at the time. You, I'm not yeah, good. You were, you, were, you were like, I'm just. Y'all know when you're. And I'm like, you're dope. Oh, thank I was like, you. You're a you put monster. me on a record. Yeah. And we yeah. just and we just started 
frightening getting into we it. We were writing and, and going. We, we, we did what? Probably three or four songs. Yeah, we was there for like a week and some change. I love you. Yeah. This this is the end. End. We don't, don't talk, talk again. again. Let, Let me say. That yeah. I love you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Where did that record end up going? Sex, Love, and Pain. Yeah. Wait, on what? Did uh, it make it? Made it? Yeah. Okay. One so of them didn't um, make it. That was dope. One of them didn't make it. Yeah, yeah. I can't remember which one that's that was. That's the one I was on. Yeah. I, think. I wasn't on that album, so uh, I don't really give a two fucks about it. I take that. Oh. I could take that. <laughs> Shut up. You Shut take up. that. I can't think of the uh, hook, though. Ah, yeah. I'm hearing that one, too. Uh, um, it was a jam. Was I want to say at least, at least one of like, your records made it. What? That's fine. Yeah, Shut for up. sure. Shut up, though. Maybe two. None of mine made it. I think I had two on your project. None of mine made That we co-wrote. Maybe. I don't remember. But at I, this I, point, even I don't then, remember. I was just like. But I was, I was so happy. I was like, I don't know what's going on, but you're fire. Thank this you. is going to be crazy when you finally do drop mm. one, and they finally do figure it out. I remember that. Was, that it was that long? I remember four those years? conversations. I didn't know. It was oh yeah, four it was four or five. That's yeah. crazy. No, I didn't no know was it four that. years or five? From the moment, from the moment I signed to the album finally coming out. Yeah, so 2009, I signed my deal. Was that 04 or 05? Yeesh. So, yeah, I was shelf. That was shelf, shelf. Was there a you reason? You can't hold me down. Was there, yeah, no, was there a reason, though? Was it just, or you just you just never know in that type of thing? It's just. They couldn't figure know. it out yet. Couldn't figure it out. I really don't know the reason. I really don't. I mean, part of it is that I had so much catalog i had so many songs that i you know started saving for myself Mm -hmm. and i could go any i was so versatile i Mm -hmm. could have gone alternative on some gwen stefani stuff then Mm -hmm. or uh i could do just real funky 80s you know what Mm -hmm. i mean that there there's this like certain characteristic of that music that i really really could do, and then there's the the, the, the hip hop, and there's the R and B, there's the there's the pop carry. So mm-hmm. I think we were doing so many different things. But that's also an issue with uh-huh. songwriters. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. you you yeah. become very versatile. Yes, yes, yes. From One day you're writing for, so for Too people. Short. Yeah. Next day you got a session with Britney Spears. Yeah, for, yeah. for writing gotta, for so many people, yes. and it becomes you yeah. in a sense. Yes. So when they ask you to be the artist, mm-hmm. you. You kind of don't know which artist you, know, you are. It, yeah. So now looking yeah. back on it, like you said, I could have done this and I could have done that. So imagine being an executive. Imagine being on the yeah. other side of that. Yeah. And this young girl comes in and she's mm-hmm. dope as fuck. And you're like, I don't know though. I don't know. I don't. I don't, I don't really know what, know what to is. do with yeah. it. Yeah. 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 I just know that it's great. Yeah. Yes. But. Yes. You want what? You want to sing? You want to rap? You want to? <laughs> you want to do some pop stuff? Pop yeah. You want to be the girl, J- Justin and, Timberlake? And you, because now, and you're walking in with Timberland and Polo, who do so much do too. Do everything as well. Yeah, they do it all they too. They were doing pop and London R&B Bridge and hip hop. And, and, yes. Yeah, so it's yes, like, yes. okay, so where do we And throw okay, some okay, D's. The, so mm-hmm. the and artist you have, yes, yes. what does she do? Where is she? Yes. And I'm in between two guys that also have two completely different approaches. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Who there's that? Because those conversations that. can get weird. Those conversations can. So I just was in the middle. Just I was just in the middle. Okay. Enjoying let's, it though. Well, let's get and you out of the middle. Enjoyable. Let's, let's get, get you out of the yeah, middle. Let's get let's get to two thousand and nine. Mm-hmm. Now you've had success Ooh. as a writer. Yes. You've had to, you've well, seen skipping. you've seen we're records skipping. go up. What? We're skipping. We're skipping. We're we skipping. can't we can't skip over the clutch. Okay. We can't skip over the clutch. No, no, we're not gonna skip over. No, we got, we got because there's a difference between her some... writing hits and her having a hit on herself. Yeah, yeah, but we we can't get into her being her, the hit artist first before we go into what she did with the clutch because what they did was tough. Like they they got busy, like y'all got busy. Y'all did some really really dope shit we before did. you became an artist. Before you, and that I mean, you was, were always yeah. an artist, but yeah. before you became a known artist. You know what's crazy is I don't even remember what order that happened in. The clutch was like first. when the. You were in the clutch before you. Before I was an artist, put out yes. Energy before no, you put sure, out, you know sure. what I'm saying? Like you sure. in the clutch first. Yeah, I was in the clutch while I put out energy, but I was kind of had, had it, it, it had already started to fade like, yeah, over a process out, of probably. like two years, mm-hmm. probably. <laughs> you about to get kicked Carrie's out. not showing up anymore, and He's I just told, I remember Toby having a conversation moment. like, "Hey, don't put me," because we had a agreement that 
we split things down the middle, make it real easy. Mm-hmm. So everything we did, and so I remember having to have the conversation like, yeah, I don't need to, don't, hey, don't put me, don't, don't put me in the credits. Don't give me no publishing. I wasn't there. Yeah. Huh. So, yeah. But, yeah, Q and I formed at some point, JQ and I, because we would write a lot um, at his home studio. And one day we just had the idea. It was his idea. And he said, we should form a writing team. And so we start bouncing the idea back and forth. Like, mm-hmm. okay, it should be girls and guys should be equal. Maybe we do. F- we had the idea of it being four. Mm-hmm. Um, two guys and two girls. And it was that. Um, we did a writing trip. and Miami. Yeah. yeah I th- is that when... I can't remember if Belay was already in at that time. He was there, yeah, for sure. He was? Okay. Mm-hmm. So, was that J-Lo? That was J-Lo. Yeah. When we got storm, we got stuck. We got stuck. We got stuck. We got stuck. Yeah, we got it stuck at, um, at Circle House. Circle House. We got stuck. I made spaghetti. I cooked spaghetti for everybody. Mm-hmm. I made spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> Just because we were stuck. Like, stuck. we got we got groceries. Yeah. Okay, well, let's. We could not leave. I was going through the cabinets like, what are we going to do? Because we can't, you know. Wasn't no Uber Eats back then. Hell no. <laughs> you had to figure it out. Um, yeah. Mm. I don't go down memory lane a lot. I really don't. Well, you but yeah, we now. did. We formed the clutch and we mm-hmm. had some great success. We brought in Candace Nelson, Ezekiel Lewis, yeah. and Balewa Muhammad. And we just had some, and his idea was actually fashioned after the underdogs. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Like, we're better together. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> on on that tip, mm-hmm. and so, so y'all was destined to break up if it was fashion after the underdogs. Shit, it just is what it is. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> Dearly beloved, <laughs> <laughs> let me step on this baby real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Bruh, way to tie it in. Way to tie it in. But it was in. never any. You know what? I'm gonna leave that alone. Hey, we don't I'll cut. let JQ tell us. Yeah, JQ been I'll on him. him. Let, yeah. Oh, he has? Yeah. Oh, he did it already? I missed that one. Ain't this a bitch? Just, 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 yeah. tell, us just uh, tell us you don't watch it. Just tell us you don't watch it. I watched watch the yeah. excerpts. I watched the clip. You know, I follow both of you. I so, watch the highlights, nigga. That's yeah, it, I nigga. see the highlights. I only tune in for Sports Center. Now, if you got a game, I don't know if we'll make that. <laughs> Look, 48 minutes is too long, it's nigga. It's too long, nigga. That two hours, good luck. That's not going to be me. Ah, I plan to. Okay. So it's all good. I do yeah, plan yeah, to. I don't listen to anything. Yeah, or why. I, I just watched TV for the first time in a year the other day. First time I've turned my TV on. And I'm talking, that's a, that includes streaming, like Netflix and all the others. I don't. Wow. I don't, no. Maybe you pass. Mm-hmm. It's, it's all yeah. good. You've been on your So I'm not rising. like a, yeah, I'm so, not so big give, on being entertained. Give us, just give us a list of the records y'all wrote that these people. Oh, God, know. don't come make on, me do come that. On, come on. Just put we it on the screen. It. Come on. All right, Icebox is one. Um, damn, man. It's a lot. So cold. So cold. Uh, I wouldn't, I don't go backward. Put yep. the, we need y'all to put the just, list. Just scroll just, the list while she's thinking. <laughs> just scroll the list. Thank you. No. Don't make, I don't know why my brain is not wired just, to just scroll the do list that. Down, Jacob, you know what I'm saying? Just scroll it down. I know just, it was, just, I don't know. I'm going to need to uh, smoke some of the there weed was like that a boy. be smoking. It ain't, mm. it ain't even that. <laughs> like a boy, um, I know there was a Kiki uh, Palmer record. There's a Mary record. Oh, Take Me As I Am. That was huh. a big one. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I mean. Icebox, I let's see. Oh my God, that was a fun session. That was my favorite song that y'all wrote. Real, Take Me As I Am? Take Me As I Am. Dope. For me, for okay. me personally, I was like, oh, okay. Nice. They got it. Nice. This thing makes sense that they put together. This, yeah. This yeah. makes sense. I'm going to go Icebox. Icebox. Over the way I That I, was cold. Take Me As I Am? Yeah. Okay. Icebox, Icebox was, was exciting. Mm. That was ex- and, and Timber, Really? I mean, favorite producer. So yeah, that was just, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's always a cheat code for yeah, you. Yeah, that, that was the Icebox where my heart used to be. The refrigerator? Shit. It's cold in here. It's cold in here. Yeah, I get it. I get it. I get it. Great record. I'm selling it. <laughs> You're selling it? You're I'm selling it. You're selling it. I want to make it too yeah. famous. <laughs> <laughs> it's not going to work. It's not going to work. Uh, yeah, there was a, uh, I remember um, there was a, 
Pocketbook. There was so many other records. It was a lot yeah. of records, but I think those were the biggest, biggest mm-hmm. ones. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right, we out of the clutch. <laughs> I loved the clutch. We're out of the clutch. We're out of the clutch. I loved it. I loved my time with the clutch. Yeah, yeah. I really did. And Q and I are still, we talk for hours at least once a week. I don't know anybody who's ever, like, fallen out with JQ. Not for no length of time. He's too diplomatic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You would never. Even if you do have a, because you're going to disagree because he is opinionated and we all are creatives and we have our, Mm -hmm. but he's so diplomatic. He's so good at, you know, being that. Yeah. Like Mm -hmm. being diplomatic. Yeah. Well, so, saying his authentic feelings. So 2009. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You've been Nine. shelved. Mm-hmm. I had been shelved. You've been waiting. Been waiting. Amen. And now it's your turn. It's yes. your turn. We, we about to get to it. Mm-hmm. Hallelujah. Now you jumping in the boxing ring. Mm. Mm-hmm. Literally. Mm-hmm. Huh? Yeah. I was at that video shoot. Yeah, you I were. walked up them stairs. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, because listen, you've been my partner for a long time. Yeah. Like we real friends. I'm like, I'm coming. Years. I'm coming to your video shoot. I'm supporting my homie. Yeah. She about to get her chance. Mm-hmm. 21 years to be exact, actually. But I was actually mad at you. Why? Because I'm like. This ain't the record. Oh. In my mind. Well, that wouldn't. In I my had, mind, I had though. had nothing to do with that. No, no, that's what I'm saying. Though. Uh, I, in my in, mind, I'm in, like. In my mind, too. To yeah. To be honest. I was yeah. like, I was like, this cool. I knew it. I knew it. My homegirl got the little, you know what I mean? I knew it. She I got the it. little, you feel me zone. And, you feel me. In her boxing gloves, you and she looked good, but yeah. it's this other Excuse record me, they got, what man. What are you feel me? Shorts? Yeah, yeah. I mean, your feel me's can be a lot of things. Yeah, yeah. It's just, it's your just. Your feel me's are anything good. Anything pop. Anything, anything popping. Poppin'. Okay. And it was all the way popping. <laughs> it's the you feel me. It's the you feel yeah. me. So right. I'm like, oh, I, lo- I love that my partner getting her shot, but it's this song they play me that I can't get away from. Yeah. It happens. No, no absolutely. It happens to new artists. Absolutely. A lot. Yeah. yeah. It's, they never ask us, mm. hey, which one do you feel? The they most proud of which one? Point. Which one represents the lane that mm-hmm. you see yours? They never ask us that yeah. shit to their own detriment, because no, because it can get tricky. It can get real tricky. It can get tricky, and you could never get to that record that you really feel like you know this what I mean. One. It could get real tricky playing that damn politics game. Yeah, but you some got records. To it. Some records you had to cut. We got, we got to it. You got to it. We got to it. But it was a light though. Still, even still, that first look. A what? Light. A light. A light. Okay. People were like, oh, like shit. potential. Yeah, shit, yeah. Yeah. I mean, people like the re- you yeah. love no, that. People record. paid attention. Yes. For yeah, sure. yeah. People did. People did. People definitely. But that uh, that rocket ship you had waiting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> fucking turn me on. Let's talk. Let's talk rockets. Okay. Let's talk, let's talk rockets. rockets. Give us the, give us the scope of that of you know, turning me on. Because to um, me, it, like the first time I heard it, it felt wrong. Hmm. To my just for some yeah, reason in my ears. ear, yeah. it felt it wrong to me. But I'm it like, took, it takes a minute. No, even but, while writing it, I understand I was what like, you but mean. This is a, this is amazing. Yeah. I remember, I, I remember where I was. Really, first time they played it for me, okay, I was it's at one of those. I was in the valet of the W Westwood. Wow, I remember to this day mm. where you were when you first mm-hmm. heard. Turn I'm like, me on. this is a fucking smash. He was playing it for you. Okay, I was like. It's over. First listen, you felt like that. First listen. Oh, so it was. It was. Dis- it the, was. There was some dissonance at first, but by the time yeah, you got through that, yeah, shit, I'm, you I'm were also like, the nigga. The first time I heard Laffy Taffy by, you know, for yeah. D for L, I'm like, oh yeah, yeah. smash. And niggas like, you're insane. I'm like, no, it's out of here. Shake that motherfucking Laffy yeah, Taffy, yeah, nigga. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. Okay. But that's how I felt, yeah. and, which is a wrong record too for a lot of people. But yes, turning me on, I was like, golly. <sighs> It was one of those. And Wayne wasn't on it yet when I heard okay. it. Okay. He wasn't, it wasn't even no Lil Wayne verse yet. Huh. Huh. So once that, okay. I was like, yeah. Polo. She out of here. Polo definitely did this thing. She's out of here. Polo's making a lot of calls. Polo was the mouthpiece. Polo was mm-hmm. making things happen. Selling it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And if you notice, at that point, we had the way I are. Mm-hmm. But like, mm-hmm. I mm-hmm. had more Polo assisted moments on my own projects Mm -hmm. than I did Tim Mm. on my own albums. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? When you look at the singles, look at the scope. Knock You Down was Danger. And that's no diss because Tim Mm. is so capable. But I think at that time, um, I think it just, he works with a lot of people. 
yeah. he, Tim was at this at this mo- at this moment he was having a resurgence. Yes. When I first met Tim, he yeah. was talking about leaving the industry. He was sure. so depressed. He was sleeping and snoring in the studio, laying on the couch. He would stroll in, didn't want to be there, talk his shit, mm, hardly satisfied. You know what I mean? But we were. I could cry about this. So there was one song I did that turned things around. And it was called They Don't Understand. I actually wrote it about something personal. And it was kind of about being shelved, actually. Mm-hmm. And it was called They Don't Understand. So being counted out, mm-hmm. right? Underdog, yeah. right? And so Tim, at, I was still living in his house. And... Every morning, I would hear that song play for like, he would be on the treadmill or his uh, elliptical for like no less than an hour. But some days it'd be three, four hours to that song on repeat the entire time. It drove me crazy. But like what it meant to me Mm -hmm. was like my like the epitome of my, my favorite producer ever. Yeah. You know? Playing, being inspired by something that I has have said, an expression that yeah. I did. Yeah. Like now the track was jamming too. Yeah. But like he really loved that song. He really loved it. I can't believe it didn't come out. I don't know what happened. But at this time, so that was part of him gaining his mojo. Mm-hmm. He had gotten He was out of it. He was out of it. And yeah. he, you know, his body and his mannerisms and everything was showing. Everything showed it. Everything showed it, right? And um, if you ask him during that, at least that one, who has, and he has said this publicly, who was responsible for, you know, he has credited us working to him getting out of his, because he just thought it was over. He was in a musical slump. He didn't know where to go. He didn't know what, you know, this is prior to uh, finding doing my love and promiscuous girl and this was all part of the resurgence the uh, records we gotcha, did the way i gotcha, are gotcha. scream yeah, yeah gotcha, like yeah. that because whole then that's era, him that's him coming back him. and changing music yes again. and i was again. there and i was writing yes this is him coming back to change music and he knew what he knew what was expected of him mm-hmm, mm-hmm. he can't just do average he can't just do like no. Trend, no. trendy. He's got to set no, the trend. No, he's got to set yeah. the trend. He's so set his the trend. that level of innovation yeah. I get it. That's yeah. a that's a lot of pressure too. Yeah. As we say, chasing ghosts. Mm-hmm. He mm. caught the ghosts. He caught, he caught them. No, he caught it because everybody doesn't catch the ghosts. No, they don't. You know what I mean? Like you chase it because yeah. you've had success yeah. and you're running around trying to find that same success again. He actually tied that motherfucker up. <laughs> okay. And again and again. Ass. Again, like because see, there's certain guy's... people you can't count yeah, out because you know where their mind. That guy's different. You know He's when different. you've done it. He's different. You you, yeah. you you could be on the brink of another, a whole nother. So anyway, so that meant, meant so much to me to be able to do that for him and and yeah. for that to turn out the way it did for me too. But I, I didn't have a lot of Tim because when we were working on that, he was still not quite there. Yeah. That happened mm-hmm. yeah. within the later part of the four years that his, right. his surgeon, he got his mojo, yeah. but yeah. he would come. Yeah. All, he would show up. He might not have, it was me, danger, me and danger. You my know what God. I mean? He Shout might not have my love danger. Who did hands. knock you down? Yep. Yeah. 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 And some, uh, uh, you know, a bunch, of other, a bunch of other, a lot of Marcella. Marcy. Yeah. Yes. That's my partner. I know. That is my That's partner. That's my dog. Both of them. Yeah. Love Good them. Good people. Great people. It was people. us for yeah. years. So, Just the three of us. So what is the feeling now? Now what is the feeling now? Mm-hmm. You've, you've, you've you written your hit records. Smash. You've kind of been on hit records. And now it's you. It's just you. It's all about you. And it's a hit and it's a smash. How are you acting now? How am I acting now? Yeah. Today? No. When you get that hit record. Oh, got it. Then. Uh, you would probably have to ask Al Jamal. I felt like you was acting bad I felt like you was walking a little different. You had like I a little, was, I was acting you had like bad a little, little bit. chest dance uh, that you did in the I video. I was acting bad shit. just a little bit. Uh, 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 <laughs> I, I, I feel like you, you know, I feel like you was look, looking over your glasses yeah, a little let bit. Me you know, I, <laughs> <laughs> let me see the monitors. Let me see the monitors. I feel like you got a little bit more spicy when I hit it. Yeah, when, yeah. When yeah. Hit. 
Yeah. I mean, who wouldn't? Yeah. You supposed to. I saw yeah. it. Shit. I saw it as a kid. Yeah. Everything it ain't I big did, shit I saw. Popping. Yeah, no huh? thing stop. Yeah. Okay. You're turning me on. You're turning me on. Wait a minute, motherfucker. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh, the check. Yeah, yeah. Listen, we remember the dance moves. Don't start that dancing stuff. I came to the tour and <laughs> shit. I was at the tour. I was like, what? <laughs> That's fucking Carrie. I was there too. We, we did the glasses. At the Wayne tour? Yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> that was like this. That was totally a part that we of the show. That we do. That's what we doing. The sound effects for the glasses. Yes. yes. I was proud. It was you was fine. having super proud. I know you guys I was were super Aww. fucking proud because I know you guys were. so many of us in this industry, mm. we come across so much talent, we come across so much drive, and it still may not fucking happen. Yeah, true. No, you know Very what I mean. True. Like mm-hmm. it still may not happen. Yeah. And you'd be like, damn, man, such and such was so fucking dope. Or maybe they quit too fast. Yes, mm-hmm. quit too or fast, just, they got right pregnant. Them, yeah. They were right like there. Or, yes. So to Something see that a, happen yeah. for you yeah. was a very, very proud mm. moment for both of us. Mm. Individually, I'm sure I saw the show at a different city. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Right, like, right, right. Come on, man. That shit was just, it was great. Right. Mm. It was great from the outside looking in. Like, Aww. oh, this is, this is the homegirl. Yeah. Cooking. Cooking. Out here cooking, trying to cook with that terrible hair. Hey man, listen, hey. you had to get there. Nobody nope. even knew I was cute for real. Oh no shit! For like uh, that's a lie. That's like that, you know what? True. We're not gonna. We don't we, we can't get that off. We're not gonna let you. Nah, we can't get you. Nah, no, no, no. Relax. No, because I was getting phone calls about you. So yeah, no, relax. relax yeah, yeah. Please, I'm, I, you probably don't remember, but I called you a couple times. <sighs> yeah. You know the homie such, such and such, such man. Yeah, he's he's seen the video. He's feeling it. No, uh, Jay. <laughs> no, I don't want you, him. You still with? Oh, all right, damn. Mm. I, you know, I had to make my phone calls, man. man listen, so yeah, they, I can't they, forgive myself. Niggas for knew that. you was cute. I nah, can't nigga forgive nigga myself because that's a choice I fought for. That's, <laughs> that's, that's, that was a choice I made. Choice I fought for. You don't get everything, but you get some things. You yeah. get some things, yeah. and it was hair for me. All right, let's pivot. Okay, let's pivot. Let's pivot real fast. We don't okay. have you for a long time. Your uh, time, you got your time. Yeah. Is, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's your time. Um, <laughs> all your gifts now come into play. You're on the screen now. Mm, mm. Yeah. You are now acting. You're uh, an actor. Uh, yeah. Trey. <laughs> <laughs> We even acted we even together. We did a movie yeah, together. A movie together. <laughs> I feel like we smashed yeah. it, too. I, we smashed. <laughs> we smashed. What was it called? Um, Lust. Lust. On Lifetime. I still get hate TD from Lust. Do you really? Ah. Oh, so this is another devlin situation. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm the devil. I, I don't know if I saw Lust. Got it. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Thanks. You gotta see Lust. Thanks so much. See Lust. I don't really like Tubi. Guy movies. who negotiated the deal. <laughs> Hey, you didn't me? see them. Didn't you know see what, the movie. Jay? You hear me? What? If there was anything, I, I don't really throw, like Tubi movies. <laughs> that... Wow. Cut that out. Tubi has great content. Cut that out. We not gonna disrespect T D Jakes t- <laughs> or Lifetime like that. <laughs> Tubi has That's great disrespectful. Films. I'm sorry, guys. And I'm sure Tubi does. I'm about to okay? go. I'm about to go purchase Lust. Lifetime. I'm gonna I'm watch. We it in my did hotel that. Room. I'm gonna watch it in my hotel room by myself. Shout out to like Swirl like, Films, my people. Two of your greatest friends. Oh, yeah, and he this knew about us. it. He acted no, like he no, I definitely knew about yeah, it. Yeah, of course you knew I about just it. Don't you, know you, if I saw you, it. Yes. You, that's why. I tried to watch another Ajmal, one. Ajmal, have you seen Lust? Yes. He no. Has not. <laughs> <laughs> he has not. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Because <laughs> there was another one that he was in yes. where he was threatening to put a nigga on a t shirt or oh, that making one was, it that one full cotton or something. Your sister saw it. That was bad. That was, okay, well, let's not talk about that. That's what I'm it, saying. So anyway, it yeah, what was anyway, yeah, it was a whole, some other anyway, shit. Anyway, okay, okay. that transition was was. <laughs> yeah. uh, it felt very seamless for you. Mm. I'm glad you did. You you were you did great in everything that I've seen. You did. Oh, you did. You. Now you're really, comfortable really good. for sure. Yeah. Thank you're comfortable. You. Yeah. Thank you. Well, good, so, great I pace. You take your time. Like and it was easy for us to work. It was just like yeah, we were just talking. We were just talking. You know what I'm saying? But I think I think that it wasn't that easy though. You now you know what's funny though. I fucked with y'all and I'm sorry. I saw the movie. I saw the movie. No, you, you want me to give you? I, no, I believe that you saw the movie. I saw the movie. Okay. I saw the movie. He was Why really he... a fucked up nigga in the movie. Tank was a fucked up nigga. What else you got? I don't believe you yet. What do you mean? He was like the nigga who just got out of jail. He was like, he grew up with your dude. 
Yeah. Come on. I saw the movie. You read the script. No, no I'm not reading read no the script. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm not in the movie. He's definitely I'm not, not reading no script. I'm not reading no script. Oh, okay. no, he I, called I, me I and asked me what I think. What I you read it? Script, what right? you think? <laughs> yeah. You good? Nah, I saw, <laughs> all right. I saw, <laughs> okay, I saw okay. the movie. I just wanted to fuck with y'all. Oh, all right. That was great. That was great. Yeah, it was. It was. I had to be mean to her. I was like, There were some awkward moments, though. There were quite a few awkward moments. I think was fresh out. Did you have Tim's on when you was fresh out? I was. I had what I had. See? They were flipping. Tim's. They couldn't afford Tim. Oh no! Budget. Yes, they were, they were, I said, look. I told look, you I saw the I movie. Said, this look at you not promo believe. shot. Look, no, I saw the I saw the movie. I saw it. I saw it. <laughs> All of it has been awesome. Um, yeah, amazing. Thank you. Thank Flowers you. to you. Thank um, you. We, of course, you know we love. We appreciate everything that you've done. Yeah. Um, they could not knock you down. What's now? What's now for you? Now it's back to music. Mm, oh, you back? Really? Mm-hmm. I love this. That's all that's left to do. I love like, this. I'm not done. Like you locked in, fully locked I'm in to this finished. music shit. I'm not finished. I'm not finished. Come on. Well, then play some motherfucking piano, done. man. Back to the music. Oh, I love hearing that. Yeah. It's needed. You yeah, need it. it took a second. It took a second. A lot of things happened. Yeah. That, that prevented it. Um, I blame it on one thing, but really it was years of a struggle. Mm-hmm. Um, amen. And you so, got through that. I fought through that. Yeah. I fought through that. But I'm free and I'm ready. Free. Yeah. You just can't, you know, sometimes you can't create with burdens, with with, with a dark cloud. Mm-hmm. Under duress. Under duress. You can try. Yeah. But creativity, I think, and... Um, I feel closest to God when I'm creating. Ah, my, 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 my. All right. Mm. Come on, Bishop. Okay. Come on. Ain't that that's the that's what they say, right? And Come that on, is Bishop. supposed okay. to Come be on, a burdenless space. It should be. It should be. That is supposed to be full freedom. I'm a channel in this moment. I'm a vessel. I need to listen. I need to hear. But there was so much stress, depression division amongst my team everything just just I mean one thing after next <laughs> like so much it just couldn't it just couldn't and then my dad died and then I then it really couldn't because yeah. that was my that was my that was yeah yeah, yeah. that was my dude so um yeah but here we are you back I feel, and it's got to feel, it's got to, when you have the freedom to, when you're not having to, when you're not struggling, you don't have mm-hmm. to f- force things out and throw things out. And you can take your time and make sure it's what you want to present. And that, I'm, I got, I played it for someone the other day. They liked it. Someone, someone who, someone. who knows, who really, really knows, who's been doing, who's been on top for a very long time. Yeah. Ooh. <sighs> he called my music Tall and Mighty. Mm. Ah, tall and Mighty. He said, I think I wrote it down. I wrote it all down because it was like, I was like, ah. And you get these, you know, you, I've had moments like that. I knew, I knew, I knew, I knew what I was doing was, if you got, how, how much longer are you guys in town? Long, long enough, enough to hear it. That's all that matters. I leave tomorrow, though, but... She gonna ask us how long we here. Because I'm trying to see if you're gonna be here when I get back. (laughs) We get back Sunday. (laughs) I leave for two nights. We're back Sunday. I was wondering if you guys would still be here. (laughs) Anyway, I would love to play it. But yeah, there are moments when you you get this, and this was like... (sighs) So anyway, we're starting to take meetings, figure out where we... How we want to do this thing. Y'all didn't lift Where we want to do this Y'all thing. Y'all didn't lift an offering, man. Like, we didn't lift it. Just put something in the, collect, the, the collection plate. You know, <laughs> go ahead and put something right here. Put I don't have cash. Can I Venmo in church? This for y'all. This, you know, I mean, the offering y'all just lifted at this. Can I Venmo in church? This praise and worship. Hey, listen, y'all just, now we can talk about God. We hmm. can go there too. Yeah. Woof. Mm. He'll let you know. The minister he'll let. Music. He'll make it real obvious. God'll let you know if you ask. He'll let you know. He wants you to know. Hmm. We want to know something too, though. What? What would we like to know, Ty? <laughs> Ty. 
top five. Yes. Your top five. Yes, sir. Oh my God. Top five. Yep. Your top five. Come on. All of these Carrie Hilson. Yes. Your top five R and B singers. Singers. My top five R and B singers. Michael Jackson gotta be in that mm. thing. Okay, Michael. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm an '80s baby. Baby yeah. Mike, Big Mike. Which one? Which one you want? Or all Mike? All Mike. All Mike. Which one? All Mike. All Mike all the time. Mm -hmm. Mike all the time. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Um, Mariah Carey's in there, I Ooh, think, because yeah. I'm talk. If we're talking yeah. mine, yours, my yours, influence, yours. this is Carey's you. list. Who matters to it. me? Who matters to you? Mariah Little me, Carey. Mm -hmm. Who raised mattered you. to Birthed who you. raised? Yes, yeah. it was Mariah. I wrote yeah. a. I wrote a. I wrote. I wrote a letter to go to Camp Mariah. Oh wow! Yes, I did. did when you, I was were you able to go to really Camp young? Mariah? No, we moved. Mom said she mailed it. We moved and I found the fucking letter. I was so mad. She didn't mail it. She didn't mail it. She didn't send it off. I had a real good shot. You know I'm a writer. Like, you know, I wrote the hell out of that letter. <laughs> Miss Mariah, I would love to. <laughs> <laughs> the essence of my soul I saw has a been commercial. changed transformed. Hey, Mariah. Oh, I found it in the drawer of the oh desk. Like. God. Oh, That's shit. a fight on Betrayal. Side. Betrayal. That's <laughs> how you rolling, Mom. My first dose. Huh? Shit. All right. So uh, Michael Mariah. Michael Mariah. Um, Lauren Hill would be in that for me. Mm, yeah. 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 Lauren. Lauren's in there for sure. Yeah. Um, dang. Let me look through my songs. Hold on. Let me yeah. see what I'm doing. what you got. Pull up your notes. I just want to look through my, my most played. Mm -hmm. Let's just Let's see. Check your uh, history. Because we had three now. Mm -hmm. We had three. Sings artists. R&B singer, but it's not the singing for miss, all of whatever. them, right? Yeah, no, it's just like just top it. five R&B artists. S well, singers. Singers, whatever. Yeah. yeah. Let's go. We're not talking ability uh, uh, or no. even agility. No. I'm just talking about my favorite R&B favorite. Favorite. Yeah. artists. Okay. Yeah. All right. Let me see. Um, <laughs> who did I say? Mike, Mariah, Bobby Brown. Mm-hmm. Bobby. Bobby Brown's high up, up Bobby there. Brown was Bobby. There. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's high. No. Yeah. And I said Lauren Hill. Yeah. What was that four? That's four. Yeah. It's cuatro. I'm going to give it to you. I'm going to give you the fifth slot. Really? Yeah. Boy, you hiding that line. Yeah. Boy. Boy. Yeah. Okay. When Jay told that story, when I said, I'm a huge tank, that was real. Like, Polo asked me to stop saying your name in interviews when they were asking me my musical influences or people that I was inspired by. Like, he asked me to Polo. stop saying Tank. Yes, <laughs> sub, sub Polo. Name. Yes, that's what he did. That's what he did. That's what he did. <laughs> yes, Polo, he did. Polo, we got to talk. You my yeah. friend. You my friend, man. You my friend. <laughs> Don't say the name no more. It's, it's, too much, it's too much Tank. It's too much fucking Tank. <laughs> No. Thank you, Carrie. Yeah. Well, I, mean, I, I don't know why. I don't know. But I, w I would, you know, yeah. Yeah. Because, like, you were, we had performers. We had, um, because I was secular my whole life, okay? Mm -hmm. um, you brought just the agility factor. Many have tried, but they didn't. You know what I mean? And there was yeah. Duran from 112, who I loved as well. Mm, you know what I'm cold. saying? But you, Yeah, he's cold as hell. Like, it was a few. It was some that could go. But, like, when we're talking, 
you you just in that R and B space. Yeah, yeah. And in that R and B space, and and yeah, you were up there. I loved That's your voice. Writing for you was really like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. It was that. So number five, Tank. Top five R and B artists yeah. of all time yeah. to Carrie Hilson. Yes. Top five R and B songs. Because we know you're a writer. We know, you know, we know what you do. Mm-hmm. Okay. Rock with you. Yeah. That's, that's a toss up. Rock with you. Yeah, I'm going to give it to Rock with you. Yeah. No, not that one. Which one? Not even that I wanna one. I want to rock with you, baby. That one. Oh, oh, oh not long. She just hit us with a twofer, though. With you lady. It's Quietly Bobby got, a two for though, because you can kind of get both of them off. You said the title; yeah. it could be the Bobby yeah. or the MJ. But "Rock with You" by Bobby Brown is, is, is so cold. Is it is cold? It's a cultural. Yeah. Yes. I like uh, that. Yeah. It's a feeling. Moment. Yeah. It's a feeling. Yeah. You feel good when you hear that. Yeah, you do. They play that. Who don't? Doo-wah. Who don't? Yeah. yeah. And it was a toss up between that and Roni, but I think I would give it to Ooh. Rock with you. You know? Ah. Ooh. It was it was a toss up in my mind. Like, ooh, which one? I mean it's your list, but, but it's a Bobby one it's, on there he's, for sure. He's, I'm he's, talking all time. It's hard to do top five hard. of all he's time. He's somewhere up there when you mentioned the 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 top ever debut R&B album cause that wasn't he would True. have been in a group but I'm talking about easy strong, like debut all the way, easy facts facts my prerogative facts. easy facts you can put that up against anything, anything. you can put that album up against anything that's very true I'm Smoke. telling you I performed as a little Bobby Brown in third grade <laughs> that was Bobby one of my Brown. that was a school talent show mom wouldn't have let me get that off yeah. nowhere else yeah. but I did every little step <laughs> yes, I did. I but I w- no, I was I doing. I did like acrobatics. The... I did baton. I did uh, just gymnastics. Like it was. I just was like, let me do something different. I ain't even sing. Every little step. Mm-hmm. I love it. Okay, we got yeah. Bobby Brown. Yeah, Bobby Brown. Every Bobby little Brown. Rock with you. Rock with Number you. one. Rock with yeah, you. I'm gonna go rock with you. Oh, oh I'm, I gotta put these in order. No, no you just okay. You just get, All right, just that's, shit that's off. one. Yeah, just get shit mm-hmm. off. Oh, breaking my heart. Pretty Bound Eyes. Mm. That's a strong one. Because mm. that's like, that was kind of the era where you started to hear live music, mm. you know, and not everything wasn't... Programmed. We're not started to hear, but yeah, yeah, I guess, I don't know. It they cut just, they through. just cut through. It just, they just yeah. cut through. A band. Cut through. A band. A and Stokely's band. voice is going to cut through. Oh, yeah. Stokely. Okay? Did, did you see his podcast, Army Money Podcast? No, she okay. hasn't. She right. don't watch I it. I didn't purpose. even know. I did on purpose. You didn't She don't watch it. I didn't even know. I'm sorry. She doesn't have a TV at home. I do have TVs. They just don't. I turn she them on once a year, on. apparently. Um, oh. Ready or not. Mm. Yeah. I'll give you everything. And more. What? Come on, Kevin. And Mayo Vin. God. Yes. He's yours. Oh. Come on. Oh, I started to, I started to, yeah. What was it? Oot baby, oh, you're looking for. <laughs> oot, <laughs> oot baby. I don't even know what he said. <laughs> it wasn't oot baby. It was oot, like oot, oot baby. Oot, yeah, it's yeah. like German. It's German. Yeah, it's like. Oot, baby. When the first time I saw him sing that live, I wanted to punch him in his face. Why who? Kevin. Kevin. Why? What? Because I, I, you can't do you, oh, that. Oh yeah. No. I do that. I, okay. Can't. In I full chest, I can get that off in false. I said. In full chest, I can't get that off. Boy, it just. Yeah, uh, and he gonna do it every night. Every night. Uh, to every this night. day. Everything. To this night. day. I mean, it just doesn't I stop. I want to punch him in his face. I'll give yeah. You. I said, nigga, you called. And I had just met and him. It was brother. my first time like meeting Melvin. him, meeting him. Mm-hmm. And that's an R and B name too, Melvin. When you when you look at Kavan, yeah. yeah. just looking Rest at him, yeah. Melvin. You 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 think one way. You know, you see, he looks like a nice, like he's just just a nice oh, he's guy. He's an aggressive yeah. singer. He's. He, for yeah. lack of a better word, he a nigga. Like that's I can't. He's, he's solid. I'm I like, can't. oh you want <laughs> oh you one of them. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. yeah, Tank, you know how it is, baby. I was like, oh shit, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, so we I'm did I'm my group did a couple shows with uh with After Seven. Oh yeah. No, but I loved still... I loved that song and I was aware of Kevin year. Like yeah. it was just okay. Oh man. Man, this is tough. All right, this one's definitely going in there. 
Don't stop the music. Peoples and Yarbrough. I don't know why it says people. I thought it was Yarbrough and Peoples. But anyway. No, it's people. Don't yeah, people's. you stop it. Don't you stop the music. You don't really want to stop. Do, 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 do. That bass line yeah. and yeah. her voice. Mm. Yeah. No, just Mm-hmm. That's who I think I am. That's yeah. who I thought I was on The Way I Are. That's how I approach a lot of shit. No shit. Mm. Is like, I think I'm her. Yeah. Oh, that's dope. Yeah. yeah. That's dope. I'm telling you. Even the most R&B record, you, mm -hmm. I swear to God. Swear to God. Swear to God. Okay, this is hard. This is hard because it could be... I got four more. Come on. I can't come do on, it. Come on, come on, Can I just on. throw them out there? I'll yes. just throw them out there. Yes. All right. Atlantic Star always. Girl, you are to me all that a woman should be. And I dedicate my love to you always. That's enough. That's enough. Yeah. All right. Okay, All right. Next, okay. next, next, next. All right. Hallelujah. Uh, Nothing even matters. Ah. Uh, uh, yeah. it's, yeah. it's one of my ones. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Soon as I get home, Faith Evans. Woo! Yes. Thank you. Thank you. I'm giving you. Thank you. I'm giving you. I get it's, mad it's at people there. if they don't know that song. What? I've been mad at some people. Like, like wait, some wait, kids? you don't know this song? Gotta I'm be a kid. Faith no, Evans and a, stand. I, I played it for an adult who didn't know it, and it was like, stand. wait, 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 wait. I have Woo! a cassette. I got, I got Faith Evans as a gift. You did? My girl at the time knew how much I love Faith Evans and got me the cassette Aww. as a gift. Wow. We need you on the podcast, Faith Evans. Yeah. Need you, Faith. Yeah, please. Mm -hmm. Love her. Love her. Um, and computer love. Ooh. Huh. Computer. Come on, Uncle Charlie. Yeah. <laughs> Shit. I couldn't do it. I'm sorry, I tried. No, that's top no, no, come on. nine. <laughs> Your top nine. Okay, that was eight. Like it was eight, wasn't it? Was eight. It was eight. Felt like twelve. Here we go. We're seven. Gonna make it your, was seven. We're gonna make your Voltron. Okay, my Voltron. Your super R and B artist. My super. We want to know okay. where you're gonna get the vocal from. All right. Where who you're gonna get the performance style from? Okay. Who you're gonna get the styling from? Who you're gonna get the passion of the artist from? And since you're a writer, top notch writer, who's gonna write the song? Let's go first. Who you getting the vocal from? Who sang in them songs? You getting the vocal from? Joe. Mm. Joe. Mm. Sorry. Joe. Cold blooded. Cold blood. Joe. Joe's like one of me. He just can't be replaced. At all. At all. Nope. And he don't miss either. No. Nope. He don't miss. You go see Joe. Studio. He gonna hit all of them notes. I, I saw radio station. I what? Asked, <laughs> I asked him one time, I said, bro, how do you do? How do you still do? <laughs> and for, oh, what is wrong with you? Every night. I've never seen him miss. I've seen him many a times in concert. With she his nice suit and cummerbund on. Not cummerbund always. What? Cummerbund. What? Let a couple buttons down and to, get I, to I it. I need to get to a Joe show. Please. I would really enjoy We it. all enjoy do. It. Joe and Keith you, Sweat you are like my, oh, the two sweat. that I Come haven't on, seen sweat. yet that I'm Come on, sweat. tripping. Because we, well, yeah. Sweat and I performed a show together. Or a couple, but sweat is a I didn't no, sweat get to is be a, a sweat fan. Is top to I want to be a sweat fan all night long. He's top to bottom, though. It's top to bottom. Hit records. Top to bottom. Oh, He don't do no, he don't fuck around. You're not getting no bullshit. Yeah, because if the list was different, if we talking... If the list was different, let's say you didn't ask like R&B, because he's he's up there in like production and writing. Oh, for sure. People just sleep. Just People just sleep. They don't, they don't they sleep, sleep on the podcast. They just don't here. know. They don't know or we they don't. Know. We tell them about the sweat yeah. on here. You do if we, all the time. Man, performance style. Okay, Hammer. Oh huh. shit! What? Yeah, I was just ha watching oh, Hammer oh, yesterday. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> 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 And I don't mean uh, style, uh, but it's like no, that. No, but yes, on on stage, that energy, that energy, man, what niggas, niggas want to fucking with they, MC? No, they, nobody, nobody, and no, to this day, nobody has energy. He enforced the stamina. Curfew. He had a he, he had enforced a curfew. the curfew what? in the. What on you his, mean? All his dancers, all the band. Oh wow! What they was not playing? Nope. Oh, they weren't playing. If you go on the road with MC Hammer, you it gonna showed. sweat. You gonna be in shape. Yep. You gonna take your ass to sleep. They were that. We gotta do this tomorrow. Okay. Oh yeah, no, no. MC Hammer didn't play. Did not play. Not mad. Send your ass home. All Styling. Right. Styling. Yeah. The, the, the drip of the artist. Oh, the image of the artist. Huh. Hmm. 
what you want him or her to have on. Hmm. Well, it's a guy voice with the energy of Hammer. That's tough. Uh, I think, I don't know, my mind goes to just super cool, like so well put together. And I'm gonna give that to, he's from Seattle. Macklemore? Hendrix, Jimi Hendrix. <laughs> I said Macklemore. That's the first thing you that came to your mind. Really? I didn't even know where he was from. <laughs> Jimi Hendrix. Jimi Hendrix. I think it would have that oh, fuck shit. it factor. I think yeah, it would have that. Yeah. It would just yeah. have the fuck it. it would, he wouldn't dress like that, but I was trying to think of someone that was kind of avant garde and I didn't want to say Rick James or anybody. Yeah. You know Why I mean? not? Because she you didn't like want Rick? tights. She didn't uh, yeah, me about I didn't want tights. Want... Tights in the. She, she, I know what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah, saying. yeah. What? I had a vision, Rich and I had to really, I, get, I, get, I had no, to really what? give it that. Yeah. Okay, okay. All right, Man, moving on. J. The heart of the artist, the passion. Heart, the passion. Who? Um, I would give that to. I would. I would. In my Voltron, um, someone that has a lot of, I guess tenacity and does their music very passionately um chris brown i think mm. come on he has a lot of reasons to sit down full mm. passion yeah full yeah he's running on all passion. yeah yes. yeah yeah yep. so he's running on yeah that's his gasoline yeah it's like his love for this shit yeah. yes yeah so i like that. love now, it. who's writing for this artist who's writing yeah You know I want to go old school so bad. You know I want to go to my favorites, but they're not really. If this artist is coming out right you. now, it'd be a matter. different writer. It doesn't matter. Okay, they will right. conform to the time. Yeah. Okay. We make a timeless music. Oh, they gotta have in it. I would. I would give it to Lauren Hill because they have the. Hmm. I would give it to Lauren Hill. I she, think she can write the rap. She can write. She the can, yeah, exactly. She's yeah. versatile. Song. They got she energy. Write, yeah. They got it's, hammer energy. Yeah. I'm not saying they're dancing like yeah, yeah. that, but they have that that mm, presence. Presence. Mm. Thank you. That umph. And she writes some timeless. Yeah. And she, I love it. Yeah, I love it. She writes in a range. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shit. yeah. Cold That's Voltron. my Voltron. She did one album, and it stood it's so still. tall, and still. still plays. One niggas start sampling her unplugged. They just wanted anything. They can, I mean, they'll any, take it any way they can get her. Anything. Bro. They'll take like, her any way on, they bro. can get her. Insane. Facts. That's insane. Huh? We got something yeah. else for you. We're not just gonna let you up out of here. All right. Not without this right now. Oh. Huh? What you got, Chief? I ain't saying no names. Uh, I ain't saying no names. Oh, Lord, I ain't saying no names. I ain't saying no names. Where you was? Who you was with? What you did? Don't say shit. Yeah. I ain't saying no. Oh, we got Carrie Hilson in the hot this? seat now. In the hot seat now. I don't like. Uh, I don't like y'all's no, games. No, fuck all that. No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I don't like your games. You know what I mean? Because you know this is this segment is important. It's important. I don't this like I this ain't game. saying no names thing. I gotta you know find I mean? a story in my head that people can't link to. Hey someone. man, listen, I, it's, it's up to you. It's your story, but mm -hmm. you gotta tell us a story. Mm -hmm. Cause you here, and this is I ain't saying no names. When you tell us a story, funny or fucked up, hmm. or funny and fucked up, the only rule to the game is that you can't say no names. Funny or And you've had travels in this game. You've been in this thing. You was on the shelf for five years. This is shit that could have happened when you was on the shelf. Um, Bunch of shit. Or when you was off the shelf. Mm -hmm. You know, what, 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 what little Lalo say? Rip me off the plastic, I'm making brand new. Yeah, when you got off the shelf, too. You know? 
Mm-hmm. You know, to, you know, the no boys allowed. You know, you know what I mean. When you were you were playing with little boys, <laughs> you told them. <laughs> playing with little boys. Ain't no boys allowed around here. Playing with no little boys. Yeah, you little ass boy. Little ass boy. Little I'm not playing. You made boy. you had chains and shit. I remember you were selling chains. Oh wow. I was like, this shit really selling chains. People still show up with but their no boys allowed chain too. What? They show up to my current. Come on, tours. come on, merch. Come, come on, on, merch. merch. With the old merch. Come on, merch. You know, Vintage can, merch. Can yes. Some about their business. Yeah. yeah. That's like, what, 13 years? Come on. Come on. Um, mm. Let me know when you're ready. Are you oh, ready? I got one. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Let me bring you on in. Hold on, shit. I'm hitting the mic and yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you one. On. Let me bring okay. you on in. Okay, announce it. This is so, Ke- hey, 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 hey. This is, this is oh, Carrie. Oh, okay. This is Carrie Hilson. Mm-hmm. You're turning me on. Mm-hmm. Knock it out. Mm-hmm. Ain't no boys allowed. You mm-hmm. better come in here as a motherfucking grown ass man. Mm-hmm. Pretty girl rocking around. Pretty, huh? pretty girl, pretty girl what? rocking around here. Cause my name is yes. Yeah, <laughs> Carrie Hilson. I ain't saying no names. All right. All right. <sighs> oh yeah. Ooh, the deep side. And took a sip of water too. Mm-hmm. All right. When you're a performer. Yes. You know, we know how important it is to give love to other performers. Yes. Right? Mm -hmm. Especially when you happen to be sitting on the front row at their show. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. I like where it's going. Mind you, no one else no one else was performing. Was anybody else performing that night? Do you know what night I'm even referring to yet? Okay, it's fine. All right, fine. Okay. Okay. For him too. All right. All right. Yes. He was there. Okay, so um, I remember just this I don't want to be here energy. Mm. I don't know why I'm here. She was with a gentleman. He was she was his guest. I know the guy very well. She was with him. So she was his you know, and she didn't want to be there. It was very obvious. And I felt disrespected by that. So when they came to my dressing room backstage, I said something and we almost got to scrapping. Shit. My Decatur came out. Her town came out. Uh, and uh, it could have got real ugly. I don't appreciate you being on the front row. Yeah. On my show and yeah. not giving me no energy. Mm, I don't remember exactly how I said it, but it, it was worse than that. It was, I'm just, I'm, yeah, I'm yeah, but it was that. It was that. It was like. We spell our artists. You already know what it's like. Yeah. You could give a courtesy bob. There's a lot of Something. things you can do. Right. It's a lot a of things eye. you can do to show to show love, but she was this. Mmm. Damn. In the front row? Mmm. She was that. She yeah, was, that's nasty she was business. Looking at the that's shit, you know, that's nasty at the business. Shit. It was nasty business, and I just <laughs> yeah. felt so. And on her phone, oh, while everybody else is standing up around here, I was just like, oh, this is intentionally rude. Like you, you want to get slapped. Oh. That's how I felt. You, you're calling me. You're speaking to a certain spirit. Yeah, you, you I dialed got it, it on up. me. I got, I got it, on it on me now. I got it on me. Okay? To a certain spirit. Like I said, I ain't. I've always been secular. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I've been okay? secular. Do they have those rocks? Yeah, she, 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 she dialed it up they, on the. They got those rocks that you call. She dialed it up. Left. That's why. That's why I got the gems <laughs> now. Keep it. Keep it, keep it all. I want to roll them like dice. Keep it all. Keep my black crystal in Shit, I'm about to get that black crystal That's why motherfuck. I got them. That's exactly yeah. why I be having because it's, it's, it's on me now. Yeah. Don't I don't like to go there, but it, it almost went there. Yeah, like people had to be ushered away. People had to be. It was it was that because I had to say something. Well, I had to say it, something. Get it off your chest. I, I had to it was figure out what the fuck yeah, yeah, yeah. it was. It was burning because I felt disrespect the whole show. Come on, man. Yeah. Come on, dog. Yeah. You don't do that Harvey unless had, you Harvey want, had to unless you are purposely, there. I guess so. Now you know what I'm talking about and who? I remember the moment. <laughs> you don't remember who it was. Yeah, she she's pretty insignificant at this point. Nah, I'm sure. <laughs> and well, yeah. <laughs> Carrie. Uh, but, uh, um, <laughs> but I ain't saying no name. You ain't yeah, saying it, no name. You didn't say her name. You ain't saying no name. I ain't saying no name. We appreciate you. Man. Um, you have 
you have put in a lot of a lot of amazing work. A lot of amazing work. Mm-hmm. And from what it sounds like, you have more amazing work to come. Yeah, we want to hear it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we are anticipating more greatness mm-hmm. um, from you. You're dope. Top to bottom. Inside and out. Yeah. We you. appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you for yeah. coming. Thank you. I'm Tank. And, and, and I'm likewise. And this is the R&B Money Podcast, the authority mm-hmm. on all things R&B. All things. This has been the amazing Carrie Hills. <laughs> My boys. Ooh, yeah. R&B Money.